Hello, hello, how are we doing? So, look, check it out guys, we have a Christmas theme background for the avatars now. I downloaded loads of new backgrounds today. Um, you know what, when we go on to the uh, gaming view, I'm going to quickly show you that. Because they're pretty cool. I was just hanging out in Pi's stream. He's playing some Atlas right now. Let's give him a shout out, actually. If you're in here and you don't already follow Pi, you should. Because he's an absolute gem. <coughs> I forgot that goes there. <laughs> Okay, so once I get on this, we're going to launch and uh, join the old Discord. <coughs> Hello. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> How's it going? I am wine. Hooray. Ah, uh, hence the burping. Are you ready to save Luminalia? <laughs> it's two minutes. It needed saving? Of course it needs saving. It always needs saving, Miz. That's no, the fundamentals of Christmas. That oh, it needs right. saving a... a week before. <laughs> calendar thing. Yeah. Well, yep. no, not that. I did that already. We're yeah. saving Luminalia, Miz. We're going to be heroes like the Grinch, but in reverse. Well, I guess the Grinch turned out to be a hero, actually. Everyone hates on the Grinch. But, I mean, eventually his heart grew three sizes and he did the right thing, right? So, frankly, I think it's prejudice that people keep going after the poor fella. We need to give him a break. <laughs> but we are also going to be saving Luminalia, whether from the Grinch or other external forces. I also don't have a friends list, so I'm just going to probably jump in and see what happens. Because I did a character reset, because I really can't be asked with Prime Stout, to be honest. Yeah, I already took care of it. Yeah. Um... I don't know, man. Like, until 318, like, PvP I don't find fun or worth it, to be honest. Or Vaughn missions. By the time we have like all of us on a multi crew ship to do a board mission, we get like 5k each. And then we might as well have just done a box mission. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Not much less money. Yeah, well, not that much less. But the board missions we were doing yesterday were like 37k between like six of us. So we get 6k. So only 1k more than a box mission, and we have back to deal with Crime Stat 3. It's just like, ugh, they're not worth it at all. Like, uh, uh, once Soft Death comes in, maybe it'll be worth it. Because even the Vaughan missions, you know, they'll send you after a ship. Like, who knows what that ship's got on board, right? But, for now, like, I just, I just don't see it as worth it at all, getting a Crime Stat. And furthermore, <laughs> we don't look for trouble, like that's not our thing, is it, you know? Trouble finds us plenty enough without us going looking for it. <laughs> so I'm avoiding Vaughan missions from now on. I really can't be bothered with them. Vaughan has fallen out of my favour. <laughs> Okay, primary residence, new Babbage. Hey, Ram. Yeah. Did you know you can actually write how many units you want to buy of something? Yeah. The number instead of having to click? Yeah. That's why I write okay. 1000. Because then I only have to press two different buttons still. 
you know. I could buy a 999, but I don't like having the weird nines. I like it to be 005. <laughs> you know, like when you do the volume on your TV, it has to be a 0 or 5, right? Yeah. And it's always really annoying because the volume always seems to have a massive jump between like 13 and 14 or something. <laughs> it's like, why is 15 too loud but 10 is too quiet? Why have you done this? <laughs> it's the worst. Did you guys get who you were going after in the end? I'm going after who are you talking to? You. Well, I saw you in, in Rack. Yeah, did you get who you were going after? I don't need details, like, but I got a message saying, oh, I got a message saying, can you man a hammerhead? And I basically said, no, I don't want the crime stat. Yeah, <laughs> he mentioned it. Nah. But I didn't join them. Asked, to be honest, like, hunting people is not what I do. Dealing with people it hunting, like hunting me. anyone. It was just shooting random people, I think. Oh, I can't fully be asked with that either, to be honest. Yeah, me neither tonight. So I'm gonna put I'm my out my Banu boy suit on, boys. We're saving Christmas. Hey, Fred. Oh, I did a calendar reset, so I've got all my swag back. And I bet, so I put my gold pistol on. Oh, I can't put my Banu knife. That's sad. We'll put a med gun on. Although, if we're doing deliveries, maybe a tractor beam will be more useful for presents. What do you reckon? Yeah. Just don't get shot, all right, boys, because... Hey, guys. Hello, hey, Fred. How you guys doing? Yeah, good, man. Calm yeah, everything good. Around. How about you? Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. A nice Sunday. Doing nothing. Oh, nice. <laughs> Are you ready to save Christmas, Fred? Yeah, yeah, I want to, I want to, I want to, I want to save <laughs> the whole fucking world. Yeah, right. <laughs> let's just let's just start with Christmas. <laughs> oh, okay, that's fair enough. <laughs> okay, let me exit to menu so I can make a party. I've now equipped myself at least. I've got to do like components and stuff. So, and I need to buy uh, med pens and ammo. No, I'm sorting okay. your beer ram, so I need a few minutes. That's okay. Take your time. Right but what I'll do is, uh, well, Rez, can you wait two seconds before you BRB? Because I'll send you a party invite before you go. I'm just literally loading to menu now. Invite do to party I... Rez, because he's going AFK. Do I need to quit uh, playing now? I'm, uh, I'm, just, you I'm can already do. in the verse. Yeah. You can do, yeah. Leslie's still in the verse yeah. too, because uh, he is buying some beers for us we're gonna stock the 890 ah. with beers because okay. I, I was remember leslie we watched well i don't know rez was watching it they did a big 890 party with all the streamers in it and they had like people dressed as bartenders handing out beers and shit now i don't ah. want to go to that necessarily level do you know what i mean we're we're pirates yeah, yeah, yeah. but you know, I thought it would be nice to have a load of beers on the 890 jump, so that if we do get dehydrated, we can get some, we can uh, mad buy some food somewhere at some point as well. Okay. And then if anyone needs a drink, we just go up to the bar. We'll role play it so that we go to the bar to drink at least, you know, but then we've got beers in the 890's inventory that we can just pull out, you know? Okay, yeah, yeah cool. That'd be cool. Yeah. Be have a drink in the bar while we're warping around why not eh <laughs> yeah uh let me get twitch also why, why can't i get on the other screen uh let me see how do i do it <laughs> how did you do it before uh <laughs> it's, i'm still learning 
I'm still learning. It's okay. Hey, Pi. Hey, Rufus, how you doing? Not bad. How about you? So, no, I got a double screen. So I got stream and I got Discord. Yeah. By the way, Fred, what do you think of the Christmas background? There's a little penguin and a Christmas tree. <laughs> yeah, I didn't notice that. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah, hey, I just realized, where's Buttspot in his PTV? Buttspot, where are you? <laughs> what's happened to Buttspot? Oh no, what's going on? It wasn't me. What the fuck? Where's Buttspot? What? I'm really confused. Buttspot should be driving around in his PTV. Oh, he's, he's, he's gone. Let me try reconnecting it. He is gone. What happened, Buttspot? I think he drove off the bridge and fell into the water. <laughs> Let me check he's not accidentally like blacklisted or something. What the hell? <laughs> okay, no, that's all fine. Is he even is he in stream chat? Does it show him as in stream chat? That's so weird. I don't, I don't know. Hello, hello Slayer. How are you doing today, Slayer? It doesn't show bot spot in my chat. Oh no. no. How has this happened? I <laughs> well, well I'm not having this. I'm googling butt spot right now. Butt spot, you get your ass back here. <laughs> <laughs> Say these commands in my channel right now, exclamation mark, join me. Fucking join me, Buttspot. <laughs> What's going on? Buttspot. I don't understand. He should definitely. Yeah. I just did the command to make him join again. So I think Buttspot might be broken. Oh, cool guy. For today. Maybe I kicked him too hard yesterday. I don't know. I don't know. Hopefully, he makes a triumphant return partway through the stream. <laughs> like Jack <from> McCleary. <laughs> 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 but Spot is lost in Pyro. Yeah. He's in a galaxy far, far away. Yeah. Leslie, we might just join on your server, to be honest, because you've got 101 out of 110. Oh, so I'm going to do that, and then we'll join you. Slayer, do you, have you got any ships that you've pledged for in Star Citizen? I'll change you from an Aurora if you like. I'm genuinely upset that Bart Sport's gone. I never thought I'd miss him that much, you know. He was always just an annoying little force there. Oh, Slayer, I was saying, do you have any ships that you've pledged for in the game? Because they're the avatars of All-Star Citizenships. If there is, I'll, I'll uh, give you a ship in it, because I know you. You're a good egg, Slayer. You don't know. I think you should know what ships you have. <laughs> what ship do you normally fly, Slayer? Okay, let's invite Leslie. You only have one. Which ship is it? It's not the Aurora, is it? Wait, are you in party, Leslie? Yep. I'm in the 
it should be. Hey. Hello. Hi. Uh, <laughs> we're on the same floor. <laughs> nice. Game 40, but I'm up at the space station. That's okay. I have to do components and stuff first. Is that is that weird name there, but but please? It says Triangle Zero. How do you make your name Triangle Zero? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Buttsbot, be there. Just be there in your little PTV. With the missiles. Yeah. I don't know anymore. But Spot's dead. Train is there. Train is there. I missed it. <laughs> <coughs> All right, since I'm going to be using the 890 today, I'm going to change my avatar. I up, I did the sizes of the 890, the Idris, the Kraken, and the Javelin made them a bit bigger because the 890 was the same size as the 600. Oh, yeah. But now you can see the 890 is properly sized. Reflect the 890 avatar. <laughs> <laughs> you have to be a sub or spend like 32 million loyalty currency to get that avatar. Jeez. So, the plan today, boys, is if you look in your contracts manager, there is, in your personal tab, a delivery called Luminalia Present Delivery, and they pay like shit, but they're very cute. It's basically okay. a box mission, but the boxes have been all wrapped up and decorated and lovely. And our mission is to make sure that these lost Luminalia presents get to their recipients. And thus right. Luminalia will be saved and everyone will get their presents on time. Okay. The Nine Tails will not ruin Christmas while we're around. <laughs> <laughs> hey, those fuckers. Yeah, these pretentious wannabe Nine Tails pirates. There's a time and a place and Luminalia ain't it. You keep your no. thieving hands off those presents. <laughs> oh no, I should have bought. I can buy med pens at uh, the gun store, right? Yeah, I should have yeah, bought yes. them at the hospital while we were there, but I didn't yeah, think. Probably. Uh, you can buy them in the gun store. Uh, is this the commons? No, this is the convention center. No, no. One more. <laughs> Dressed for the occasion. Yeah, that's really nice. Like, I had a silver one, but I melted it again. Yeah. The gold one is better. Yeah, the gold one's my favorite, to be honest. I don't like the red one at all. I think it looks really plasticky. Yeah. Like, some people like it and each to their own, but it's just not my cup of tea. 
The silver one looks a lot better than I thought. I saw it in someone's video the other day. And I said, yeah, the oh. silver one is alright, yeah. Yeah. Oh. What happened? You ran into it. You ran into me and I got hurt. I, I got hurt. I, I ran into you, did I? Yeah. Are you sure about that? <laughs> or, I, or I ran into you, I don't know. I think that's more With the desync, you never know. Yeah. I can't believe BartSpot's not here anymore. I feel so alone. <laughs> <laughs> Buy me a whole other ammo, also, yeah. Uh, I need ammo. Oh, I'm going to be using the arc pistol. Let's buy some grenades as well, they're always fun. <laughs> Meeting at Microtech? Yeah. We're gonna go show Fred the Christmas tree if you've been there. Have you been to the Christmas tree before? No. I haven't, no. Uh... Oh, we can show you as well then. Well, one good news already, the beer is secured. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm just buying some handgun ammo. Carna rifle battery, let's buy our Those kind of things well. I need to. I don't have anything like that. It should be okay. I don't think these missions are actually have hostiles, but you know. It's better you never know. Than story. You never know. Yeah, I have my arc arc pistol. That's it. <laughs> I mean I, I have probably other guns, but uh Yeah, a lot of guns. Yeah, I'm using my art light today. Because I'm dressed I'm like a banu. I'm gonna use. Well, I have a glimmer version, which is orange. If anyone particularly likes sniper rifles, I can give you a gold arrowhead. As <laughs> so I don't use them. <clears throat> this one, I'm gonna use this one. Uh, shotgun. There. That's just for the occasion then. Twenty med pen should be enough. Apparently, we're getting three eighteen in a few days. That'd be exciting. Yeah. That's from the wipe is in a couple of days. Yeah. I don't know how true sure. that is, but that's what someone in the in my Discord was saying. Yeah, Granny. Play I wanna play a little bit of the uh patch. Cause like last last season they they gave payouts based on how much you played the previous patch. Yeah, they were very generous with it as well. Uh, I didn't log in that much, but I got 38 mil. Last wipe. Yeah, me too, yeah. Hopefully they mess up again and give everyone yeah. loads <laughs> of millions. Yeah. I haven't had to buy components or patch, it's been great. Especially since this patch has been like a year long. I haven't had to buy anything for so long. Yeah. If they actually yeah, do too. the work properly and don't reimburse us all stupid amounts, I don't know honestly how I'm going to cope. <laughs> I haven't had to make money for like a year and a half in this game. <laughs> so in the universe there are aliens, Granny, but like they're not in the game yet. So like there will be aliens in the game at some point. Actually, Luminon. What's Lumini? Luminalia. Luminalia is actually an alien holiday. Yeah, yeah. it's basically alien Christmas. Yeah. So there's aliens, which is not in the game. Yet. 
I really wish the defender would fit in the 890 jump hanger. Are you getting your mule out? He feeds just. Not uh, yeah, I'm, I'm on my way to the to the train back to the port, and then I get my mule. Yeah. All right, there. Right, I'm gonna just hop to the colons and. Uh... I'm freaking lost. Which should I pull out first, my Centurion or my 890? Uh, yeah. I mean, <laughs> yes, of your, your 890. Okay. Because then you can land with it and then go back in for the car. Oh, this is the same train that I rode first when I entered the game. Can, you can recognize it from the ammo. Oh, then I went the wrong oh, way. <laughs> I found a present. Hooray! Good for you. <laughs> Another one. I went the wrong freaking way. Don't tell me storing is unavailable. What do you mean? Just stay on the, the train with tram or what, something. Oh, yeah. It stores it in my, in my suit. That's unfortunate. Yeah, it's like it's on sale right now. It's like forty dollars to to get a starter package. Also, if you use a referral code and you buy a starter package, both you and the person whose code you use will get a free Argo Cargo spaceship. It doesn't have a quantum drive, but it's a pretty cool little ship. It won the uh, best in show last year, so. Uh, I'm gonna pick up my package before I come to you guys. No problem. I still need to do components to be fair. From the best in shopping, dining, and entertainment. Be sure to visit. Uh, so you want a mule then? Yeah, go on then. All right. But that can be used to put the presents on. Yep. Keep them all in one place and tidy. Okay. Oh, I forgot to put the the, the paint on it. Damn. Boo! Boo! I bought it specially. Boo! <laughs> <laughs> Smokestack. Remember, yeah. to that concierge paint. Hell oh, yeah. Yeah. But I forgot. That's very sad. You've ruined Luminalia for everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Open the freaking door. Okay, Harvey's kid out again. Centurion uh, can, I guess, stay with that. Guys, they won't let me out. Help. I'm there. Yeah, what do you mean? <laughs> I'm in the garage and he won't open the door. Oh, uh, is all very good. Did you call, call the, the right, right one? one? Yeah. yeah, 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 there are two in the... Yeah, no. yeah. Are you sure you called the Just right call one? Both. <laughs> and then... Tired of travel? Mm -hmm. Why not rest at the next newly renovated accommodation? Located downtown in the luxurious Aspire Grounds. Yeah, so I, I really love the mule. It's a little crazy toy. <laughs> Yeah, I love the mule as yes. well. It's probably my favorite ground vehicle, to be honest. Yeah. It's just so much versatility, like yeah. so much use for its size as well. Like you can fit that in so many small ships, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Be sure to explore all new Babbage has to offer, whether it's the latest in cutting edge technology or the beauty of our award-winning gardens. The city of tomorrow. 
Other cargo, I'm probably not going to use. Defender. So I'm just trying to sort all my components out quickly before I call out the 890. I suppose I could do it on board the 890 while I wait for everyone to load stuff up. But I've already started. No. <laughs> Maybe I will make a military grade Argo cargo the just because that's hilarious. <laughs> I mean, we could bring the Argo Cargo as the snub, but I would rather have, like, Leslie's Pisces or something. I feel like that's yeah. more useful and nicer. And it has a quantum drive as well, in case of an emergency. The moment it's going to be the one hundred die. Well, either way, it has a uh, quantum drive. At least it's origin. Which, <laughs> yeah. My Argo Cargo, with, with the best will in the world, if we end up stuck somewhere, it's not getting out of there. Oh, I can give it a grade A military power plant. The coolers are too small. And it's got grade A military shield now. Go on, <laughs> military Argo Cargo! That's beautiful. Oh, I'm not going to change weapons on most of these ships, just components, because most of them are like. Like, I'll change it on the Bucky, the Hornet, and the, well, not even the Defender, but like the C2 and stuff, you know, like, I don't really give a shit what weapons the C2's got. Yeah. So that'll save a bit of time. This isn't the most thrilling side of Star Citizen chat, but once it's done, it's done. Now oh, where the fuck is my helmet? My protest. The Empire's leader in cutting. Wait, what size does a very puck S4 gimbal mount let you put on? Does that let you put I, size threes on? Size threes, yeah. So where would I put a Drake Buccaneer spinal mount on? Oh, because I can put two size twos or one From size three. I see now. Yeah. Never mind, this ignore me. Is this package below the floor? They can do that sometimes. <laughs> so what do I do? Abandon it. Why not okay. rest at the left newly renovated accommodation? Located downtown. Unfortunately, there are still a lot of cases where it's just, it's not working, abandon it. But hopefully those get less Remember, and less. Your belongings belong to you. Keep a careful watch on all personal items. Bucky, okay, Caterpillar. Don't care about weapons on this. You guys hear me? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Ready to upgrade? Look lying on the, the ground with my VR headset. <laughs> Why are you lying on the ground? Stop my back today. Because oh. now I can play. There's no program that's like set up for people lying down in VR. Can you imagine why? That's like the first thing you want to do is watch a TV show while lying down on your face. Like you watch it on your face, I mean. Can't imagine. Vorpex almost made it. We can tilt the screen 60 degrees. But it's 60. If it was only 90, it would have been perfect. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Uh, calling the 890 out now. Yeah, I'm uh, almost there on uh, on the ice. Nice. Uh, set, same place. Good timing. Yeah, absolutely good timing. Yeah. 
think someone's on my ship. Does the elevator go up automatically after a, a few minutes on the on the um, on the uh, Corsair? Uh, I think so, but what you can also do is press F1, uh, click on your comms, and then there's a there's a channel for your ship. You can see if anyone else is in there. Why are they already opening my hangar? Uh, who knows? <laughs> what? Hey. But if I haven't reached times, my ship right. yet. If they Sometimes they, they do that. There, Maybe right. that's another one. Nearby. For I example, I got hangar 17. Damage the roof. And opening the roof now, so you may hear that. No, my roof is open. I can see the sky. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I watched the doors opening. So this elevator, not right at the back, the one like before this one, the big cargo elevator is obviously where we'll be putting the uh, Centurion and Mule. Yep. space on it. Uh, what I like about the mule is you can swing it around like a fucking turret. <laughs> That's cool. Take quarter arms as well, boys, just in case anyone tries to disrupt Christmas. Yeah. Oh, now the roof's closed again. Uh. Oh, odd. You are clear to launch. Another silver bird. Yeah. That's cool. It is. Uh. Yeah, it has a teal accent coloring. Oh, yeah. Thank cool. you. What's that? Is that a. This was for the Foundation Festival. Okay, cool. Thank you. Nice. down at the uh, ground garages. Actually, I'll come over. To, should I fly over to the commons just because it's going to be easier to park there and get the Centurion out? Oh, you can't go there. Fred is going to take a while. <laughs> <laughs> you better I get just started. Got there. Damn it. I have to wait <laughs> all the way back. I came from there. <laughs> yeah, do it. Go, go back to the commons. I don't feel I'm, like trying to park this under that tiny bridge. I'm coming with you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so you don't feel alone. <laughs> Made a micro attack. Yeah. I should be flying over you guys any minute now. 
We can jump! Yay! <laughs> Oh, that? Oh, that was cool. <laughs> I turned the recording just in time. <laughs> I didn't get Fred's jump, but I got the 890. Another chance, another chance. <laughs> no, it's not gonna jump. Not all of them is like that. Behind me. That's cool. This is the 890 Jump Slayer. It's the only capital ship we currently have in the game. It is a luxury cruise ship. You can see it when you do a board urgent mission boarding action in progress. Are you in a ship, Leslie? I'll le I'll leave the hangar open before I jump out. If you are. Yeah, please do. Yeah, please. I'm breaking the beer, so better leave it open. Right, engines are off. How much? Like thirty-three million. One thousand. No, I One mean, thousand bottles of they beer. They were asking how much the eight ninety cost. Oh, thirty-two million. It's worth it. Oh, I forgot the hangar, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I'll send the lift up and I'll climb in through the cargo elevator so I'm on the right floor. Actually, it's quite cool to have a, sm a very small ship. It is. Ah. I mean, I would like a little bit of redesign in the interior, but um, otherwise I love this ship. It's uh, the 100 series, yeah? Hmm? Sorry? Yeah, this 100. One, yeah. This yeah. is the 100i. Okay. The base type. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This yeah, is the, the only the ship. I have paid money for. Oh, really? I mean, not this one, another one, but I, I, I wanted this paint, but it cost too much because you could only buy it with a, a new game package. Okay. You and have 888 um, points. Ram was crazy enough to gift it to me. <laughs> Wait. Where are you, Slayer? I think you I've don't. Got a... You have seven thousand five hundred and thirty-one. It literally says that. <laughs> and there you go. I'll give you then ten k. There you go. Enjoy, Slayer. You type exclamation mark treasure or balance or credits or X or UEC. Any of those commands, and you can check your currency. All the avatars have the price that's... Oh, channel points. Well, that's not what you use for anything to do with the avatars, apart from for actually having the minigames. You, you trigger the minigames with them, but you don't buy the avatars with them. You buy them using the current. Okay, hangar should be going up. I pressed open, so... Yeah. It should be All going right. up. We are arriving slowly with Fred. Almost, almost there. Okay, I'm running to the back to Come open right the cargo the bay for you. So Fred, you'll be able to drive into the cargo bay. All right. Just uh, make sure once you're on, you like stay there so you can 
put the lift down for me as well. Yeah. as far forward as you can, Fred. Yeah. I'll go get the uh, Centurion. Seventeen clicks out, and then Many once. Of, uh, waiting anybody for that? We're we still at New Babbage. We're just um, on the ice lake. If you come fly down, meet us. Well, I need to store my ship. I don't want to leave my ship there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, if you go once you've stored it, if you head to the commons. We're currently okay. right by the surface Welcome exit for the commons. The vehicle retrieval okay. system. Please visit us again. Goodbye. Welcome to the ASOT vehicle retrieval system. Oh no, I broke the screen. <laughs> Is actually broken. What the fuck? How did I manage Please this? Visit us again. Welcome. Goodbye to the ASOT vehicle retrieval system. Vehicle selected. Oh. Yeah, Stand back. Actually. Your vehicle has been delivered Please to the following location. Again. Goodbye. Have you done anything interesting this weekend? Yeah, yesterday we were doing loads of combat beacons and just random missions. It was pretty cool. Yesterday was fun. Uh, yesterday was really fun, yeah. Today, basically been chilling, did some laundry, drank some wine. <laughs> They're saying, please proceed to assign landing, bro. Yeah, That's what they said to you, the, isn't it, Fred? Yeah, you pressed the wrong one. The comments, yeah, that one. Yeah. <laughs> but they don't give you much space I'm, coming out of this door. Oh, it's... <laughs> barely. I'm, uh... What the hell is this? This is the Centurion. It's a ballista basically, but with a turret instead of missiles. Why not? It 
it's an anti-air defense. It needs guns. I don't know if it's actually going to fit. Otherwise, I'll uh, move to the side. Let me yeah, check I if you're in. Yeah, I think you need to move to the side. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I can. Uh, you, you put it in, and I'll put it in the space that's left. Alright, oh. yeah. Yeah, I'll pull, I'll pull as far forward as possible and then you jump in. Yeah, let me get in the... in that thing. This doesn't... the, the Centurion doesn't have that many guns, like it's only one hammerhead turret. The hammerhead has six of those turrets. <laughs> thing yeah. is like it's gonna overhang the actual hulls there's i don't think there's actually room for both of these vehicles to be honest yeah i'll give it a try i can okay. tell there's no there's no room for these vehicles really yeah because look the lift is bigger than the hole so like i have to literally be in the middle of it or i'm gonna clip the hole as we go up yeah. And because of the the way the nose of the Centurion is shaped, like yeah. the wheelbase is smaller than the top of the Centurion. <laughs> yeah. No, well, I can um, get my cutter and put it in the cutter and then, or the uh, Corsair. Can do. I mean, we don't hugely need them, you know, to be honest. We can, f we should be able to fit three boxes in this if need be in yeah. the Centurion. Okay. It's a shame, though. I thought the A90's cargo was way bigger than that because it's yeah. like massive when you're stood in it, isn't it? Yeah. In the world, yeah. Ram and I press the button. Huh? I can raise you up if you are all set. Uh, I am all set. Also the commons. Okay, there should be a planetary exit like between the where you arrive in the commons and the promenade. Yep, I know where it is. I'll uh, pick you up there with the uh, with the cap. Oh no, I got no room for this for the passenger. No, no just just come no. on board, Fred. We we want to all be on the, the same ship, really. All right, I, I can leave it here. Yeah, you'll be all right. right. We'll get you on the turret in this thing instead. Okay. <laughs> all systems offline. But I've seen the swimming pool. Maybe I'll do some swimming then. Maybe. Oh yeah. <laughs> we'll just chill in the chocolate tea. Yeah. The sauna. The sauna. Yeah, I there's plenty of the ground elevator? space in the Centurion and we don't we don't have seats, but if you just lie on the ground when we're driving how, you'll how do right. I open the elevator? Oh. There's oh no, well, why did you use that one? <laughs> huh? It's alright, don't worry. I just opened the door and, and the elevator started going down. <laughs> How do I, how do I call the, ah, there's something coming down here. Oh, that's a big one. Yeah, okay. there's, a, there's like a smaller one behind it. Okay. Are we heading in again? Yeah, you can uh, push the button, I'm, uh, well, I'm inside the Centurion because when I was going to get out, you pushed the button and made the elevator. I did. Down. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> so oh, send okay. us up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't do that. I can't get to the other side because you're in the park. I think I found 
If you go up, the hole will be there. You'll probably get stuck. Well, if I go up, we will get stuck. Yeah. It was outside of the... Okay, don't press anything then, I'll readjust. But yeah, don't use the cargo elevator, use the back one. Yeah, this is, how come it's spun round? What the fuck? I had engines off and everything. Yeah, that's probably because the door hit it on the way down. Yeah, you see the, the other light behind me? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that caused the other lift. Okay. That's too far back. Yeah, I can press the uh, the other one. Yeah. Okay. You can send me up first as well if you want quickly. Okay. Yeah. Because I think I'm in the right position. All right. There you go. Thank you. And the one further back actually skips going into the cargo bay and just goes straight to uh, the foyer. All right. So the back one is better. Yeah. It's getting a little bit chilly also, yeah. <laughs> yes. You're on? Yeah. All systems offline. Yeah, we're on now. Oh, he's clipping through the elevator. <laughs> yeah, so <sorry>, yeah. <laughs> oh, the elevator is gone. We're floating. <laughs> okay. Um, which way I have to go now? Because last Straight time ahead. I was on it, I was uh, freaking lost. Straight ahead, and uh, when you are in the atrium, just go up two levels and find the cockpit. Uh, we're or in the, the bar. Now. Oh, bar? Bar? Did you say bar? Where? Yeah, the bar is downstairs, a floor, so go down one, a floor one, and then no. turn 180. Just come where I am, I'm almost at the bar. Just stuffing things into the ship inventory from the mine, like. I'm gonna move us further beams. towards the Christmas tree. It has a bar. Oh. Yeah, this ship has a bar, a spa with pools. Like it's got like I two or three swimming a, pools. A spa. I am in a swimming pool. What the fuck? It has a sauna. <laughs> it has like four apartments in it. Like full apartments with dining room, bedroom, aquarium captain's quarters it's got a huge cargo hold with a basketball court in uh is it the hangar or the cargo hold that has the basketball court in i don't know hangar hangar it's got the a basketball, basketball court. court somewhere jeeves uh, i don't know where uh, <laughs> <laughs> sounds so like and the croquet like... field of bean for the upper back. class evening <laughs> <as you know. laughs> hey guys hello, hello. I just want to tell you, we have a large, up here. I have a, we have a large fleet if you want to start some trouble. No, like no. <laughs> okay. I'm avoiding trouble. We're <laughs> saving <laughs> Luminalia. <laughs> Alright. Where's the bar? Where's the barkeeper? Are you winning, no? Uh, we just we just have a fully uh, manned retaliate and a few escorts. So, if you are in trouble, let us know. Okay. Yeah, cool. Enjoy. Have a good one, my Thank dude. You. you too, my mate. Everyone's on board, so I'm going to start moving us towards the uh, Christmas tree. Where are you, Fred? Yeah, there I'm you cool. yeah. Here you go. Well, where do you get that beer? <laughs> That's Orisa. great. I bought it in Orissa. <laughs> This is cool. Don't dump your bottles outside of the bar. If you're gonna drop bottles, let's 
go from in the bar area. In the bar area, all right. Come on, oh, I can take my armor off. Uh, put it in the vehicle then. Where is your... this armor? <laughs> the same as mine. Yeah, I, I, I uh, melted it again. I did not oh. like that. Yeah, I had uh, the silver one. I see. Yeah. But I, uh, I've got the two uh, red ones, red alert ones. Um, All right. Well, I can. It's so nice to be just a passenger on a huge fucking yeah. ship, yeah. loaded so drifting good. through New Babbage. Yeah. We're almost so at cool. the Christmas tree, boys. At least as close as this ship's gonna get. Well, I sa save the rest for last. Yeah. yeah I rode the Centurion. Yeah. This uh, is. Uh, I this mean, is cool. we can we can go. Maybe we can go the whole, whole, whole way in. Uh, my now I'm way. landing. Just outside under the bridge, so we should be. Nicely come away. here. You can see the hotel from here. Yeah, the Christmas tree is literally underneath a spire grab. Um, let me out and then yeah. So if okay, you if you if you crouch and look up, then you can see the hotel. It's where the train tubes connecting to it. Yeah, that's where it is. So oh, are, yeah, we, yeah. are we going to use the Centurion RAM? Yeah, why not? Alright, then let's go downstairs. Yeah! Okay, hangar actors. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, that was you calling it up. Sorry. <laughs> no worries. Come on then. Oh. Bye. <laughs> Let's use the other one. I guess that's because I already pressed hangar access. Uh, yeah, hang. Oh wait, we want cargo, not hangar, so we want this way. I always get muddled up. See those boxes, Fred? Those are yeah, all aboard the Centurion. I'll send the elevator down okay. and run aboard quickly once everyone else is on. There's only one extra seat on this inverted. Yeah, we're gonna have to uh, have two people just lay on the floor, unfortunately. <laughs> Alright. I don't have the spine. Well, that'll be okay. Should have grabbed an Ursa instead. Yeah, that's true. Good down, Fred. Okay, sending down the elevator. Leslie, if you'd like to drive, I'm now getting in the turret seat. Save us all bumping into each other on the way down. As you wish. I mean, well, I found found the right spot. <laughs> I'll be right back, guys. I have to up the lights for a bit. One moment. No problem. Although, actually, once you're off the lift, Leslie, let me know and I'll jump out and close it again. You can do it. minutes I'll just run in. Uh, you, you can you have time to come back. Why wouldn't we wait for so you? So the, the opening is to our left. Yes. Guys who haven't been there, if you want to like peep out the front, if you can, you'll see like the. T it's kind of like a hidden entrance that you have to take to get in there. It's pretty cool. Oh, 
it's actually smooth, you can stand up without too many issues. At least until Leslie hits that snowbank, then we'll see. <laughs> then we'll see. Well, this was surprisingly smooth, it didn't launch. the challenge. <laughs> Not even the terrain was made for this. Here we go, Luminalia Central. This is more just to enjoy a bit of sightseeing while we decide what mission to do, you know. Yeah. yeah, go on, pull four more. Pull, pull right in there. Perfect. Here we are, gentlemen. Le Leslie, before you get out, you might want to uh, reverse a bit or something. The steps are flat to the ground. Oh, you can get back in there too. Oh, I think they added another tree. There's more presents here. I swear this has changed. Let me see. I mean, I should probably wait for Fred. I don't remember the lights being purple, green, and yellow. Like I think they're oh, different they colors. Everywhere. And there's a weird palm tree, Christmas tree, in the back now that I don't remember being there either. Ah, oh, nice. But it still has the rays, right? Huh? Up there, it still has the rays. Yeah, it's still got the wreath up there. Okay. Star Citizen. Pretty dope, innit? Yeah. And look at the derpy snowman, he's so cute and grumpy. What the fuck? I have a crash that's that? what? For why? That's a funny big snowman. Why do you have firm step one? I have no idea. I didn't do anything, so I don't know. But he's still inside. Check your uh, journal. I, I can see. Oh, what's... this snowman's the cutest. He doesn't even have a mouth. He's so short and fat. <laughs> Armist is <my> age. <laughs> Look how dumb he what did is. I do? <laughs> Okay, we don't know how long Fred takes, so I'm gonna check it out. I love all this snow. That snowman looks like uh, Sid from... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> except yeah, if his head was squished a bit more. I don't know, Ram, it looks different. basically the same, except this tree. Yeah, I don't remember this tree, and I, I swear the they were like different here, colored lights. And the lights. presents, yeah, but I mean, these, these presents were not here. The big ones, yes, but these are, in these here, no, and not, it, the tree wasn't here. Was there always two Christmas trees here? Yes. I like this snowman. But we can check, I have aluminum. Hey, this guy's got a concierge top hat on. Oh, that's Sweaty. new. <laughs> that is new. This, this snowman's got one, a concierge hat on. on this yeah, one this too. one has two. <laughs> but they don't have monocle. Yeah, uh, peasants. Can we see down Imagine now? if you Again. could loot it. Ah, still, still no. 
Uh, it was so cool to be able to sit down on these benches. Get in the driver's seat while we wait for Fred. Alright. I love this place. It's so cool. I'm gonna stand in the fire. Bogey. Maybe it makes me a little bit. Nope. Originate My contact is so fucking cold that. Even the middle of the, the campfire is minus 62 degrees Celsius. I think I know what made the armistice violation. It's because the door is open. So if it damages the ship, it counts as an armistice violation. Well, where were you stood, Leslie? Oh, you're by the fire. Cool. I didn't want to run you over. It's your Luminalia. <laughs> <laughs> I love this play though, it's so festive. I'm gonna do another one because the, the center in the background is also cool. Hopefully Fred gets back soon. I don't know if he thought we were going to take long to get here or what. It's not Maybe hard. he didn't think his wife takes so long. Oh yeah, true. It's not long to get here, it's just quite tucked away. Like, if you don't know this is here, you could literally play for years and never even see it. Yeah. There's like some little benches with a bear sat on it as well that Leslie knows where they are. I never there are two of phone. those, but I don't know the other one. The other one is near one of the observatories mm. on the top of a hill, but I haven't found it yet. Centurions look such god awful bloody screens it's the same problem as like a lot of other ships but still apparently I can't even put self status as a screen the 890 jump is red I think Maybe it's because. Oh no, you're 100 dollars red. Yeah. I'm gonna pay my fines at the commons, no problem. smoke and if Fred isn't back by the time I finish rolling then I guess we'll have to show him another time. Yep. Because I don't, with the best will in the world, I don't want to be sat in Christmas town all night. Christmas ain't going to save itself, boy. Hey, your, your right front tire is really anxious. Yeah. My God. Or excited, <laughs> at least. It's filled with Luminalia spirit. That's what. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be AFK for one minute. 
Oh look, this, the new Babbage Snow really makes my stream background pop, doesn't it? Okay, I'm gonna check it out before I leave. Oh, cool. Doesn't it look cool with the snow background? It looks cool. And we've even got the Christmas tree there. Nice. Hooray! That looks so dope. Can I show? Oh yeah, I was gonna show you guys the other one. No, While you're still in stream, let me show you. I'm gonna land near the funny blue thingy. Let me show you some of the others. So we've got uh, this one, which says follow. I did lower the ground, but it's just a generic like grasslands with a bit of water. We've got evil biomes. <laughs> We've got a Halloween planet. We've got like a luscious microtech area with nice grass and a little bunny. We've got that, but without the annoying trees in the middle to obstruct my stream. <laughs> We've got another form of lush microtech, like maybe microtech river, if you will. And again, that without the annoying trees. And you got snow biome Christmas themed, snow biome no Christmas. Then you've got what? What is this from Slime Rancher? It's called Dry Reef, but I like to say Dema slash Aberdeen. And then you've got Dema slash Aberdeen without the big cliff faces. There's some nice varied planets there, but of course we're saving Luminalia, so we want our Christmas one. <laughs> but yeah, we've got quite a few different planets we can take the stream fleet to now, depending on what we're doing. <laughs> Is Fred back yet? Yeah, I'm back. All right, get out. Just, just, <laughs> just get out. Okay, <laughs> where you want me to go? Get out and then run to this. Run round. Run round the other side now. No, round the other side of the Centurion. Turn around. Ah. Oh. Oh. I think you can see what we would like to show you. Ah, oh, yeah, that's back. cool. Look at all the snowmans, and look up, there's like a big wreath that says Star Citizen hanging over the area. Pretty cool, huh? Ah, uh, that's cool, yeah. You got back just in time, I was like, if we, if I've rolled my smoke and Fred's not back, we're just gonna leave. Ah, and then you, you were back. But yeah, this, yeah. Is a, this is one of the cooler spots. Obviously, it's here all year, but obviously at this time of year, it's particularly... Uh, um, I can't change it to the Corsair Pie because the Corsair does not have an in-game price yet. I can only gift ships that have in-game price because I can set then a loyalty currency price. Whereas at the minute, it just doesn't have a loyalty currency price. Uh, it is available to sub, but because... So basically, the way you set up the avatar shop is it's currently listed as for zero credits and you have to pay zero credits and be subscribed. So only subscribers can access it. So once CIG release it into the game with an in-game price, I'll update the shop so then it will be the in-game price or subscribe. And as soon as that patch comes and I can program it to have an actual loyalty price, then I can change it. But until it's, uh, I can't gift sub only avatars. For, it, to be honest, doesn't really make sense. Like it's my fucking stream. <laughs> what, what, what do you mean I can't gift it? Oh, it's over I just went big dick and subscribed. <laughs> Cool. Now you can choose yeah. any ship you want, Pi, and it will, or even capitals, any ship you want. Because if you stopped, you basically pledged to me, right? So, and basically, right, at Christmas is going to be my last follower giveaway, right? So, before we've used the loyalty currency, the credits, if you will, or the pirate gold, to buy yeah. tickets for giveaways. This 
uh, Christmas is going to be the last giveaway where we do that and going forward because I know I know people like to lurk for channel points and shit and for loads of coins I don't want that shit happening anymore my giveaways are meant to encourage new players and stuff and I'm probably not going to do game package giveaways anyway so what I'm going to be doing is You've still got the last one at Christmas to spend all the channel points that you've been fucking hoarding up because I know what you lot are like. So you, I'm not going to just invalidate those credits. But um, come the new year, giveaways will be subscriber-only giveaways. So basically, subscribers, instead of spending your coin on avatars, you'll spend your coins on giveaway tickets, you know? And that's how I see it working in my head. And it might seem a bit scummy, but... You know, I don't get CIG sponsored giveaways. I pay for the giveaways. And... I need to give people more incentives to actually subscribe on Twitch. So the avatars is one and the giveaways is another. And you know... I probably shouldn't say this, but I mean, there's nothing to stop you from going, Oh, Rummy's holding a giveaway. I'm going to subscribe for one month and pay $5.99 so I can enter the giveaway. I don't even think it is $5.99, it's like $3.99 or something. But you don't have to be subscribed to earn points. You would just have to be subscribed to use them in the giveaway, you know what I'm saying? So I don't see it as hugely unfair I don't see it as unfair at all but I know people like to cry about things like that ah Leslie's hopping out to lower the lift thank you Leslie you're welcome I just have to find the fucking button for it Soon, the Luminario Adventure. Oh, the Corsair is actually a decent size. It looks like it flies with the wings folded up. It should probably be oh, way yeah. bigger as well, but you know what? It's that cool. seems a decent enough size. I think it's more that the starter ships are too big than anything else. Yeah. At this stage. Because <laughs> I scaled the 890 to the Javelin and that. Cool, that one looks pretty cool though. All systems online. Badass. <coughs> it's lowered, right? Like, that's not still folding down or anything. No, that's finished for you. For some reason, when I moved, it looked like it was still moving down. I didn't want to break it. Perfect. Everyone on board? Looks like it, yeah. I think everyone's on the lift. Okay. Yep. Fred, wait till we stop moving before yeah, you yeah. open the side. Oh, Slayer, I didn't see you redeemed a battle royale. Oh, wait, yes, I did. I did it. Let's do another one so we can see Pyre's Corsair in action. Okay, we're up now. I need to go to the commons round. Okay. Is there any... Oh no, you can't just pay off your crime stat at a facility, I can. can you? I, I can. mean, like, at a random facility. Yeah, but at the hotel I can pay off. Uh, I can use my point. ship. <laughs> yeah, that might be an idea. I just ran to the hangar instead of the lift. It might be quicker. Right. Uh, I'm gonna try 
up on medical and set my respawn. That's an idea by the way guys, you can uh, set your respawn in the med bay of this ship. If you haven't already, just in case of any accidents. Okay. How do I get there? Uh, head I'm, to where I'm, I am. I'm so lost in this ship. Jesus. <laughs> head to the back yeah. where the... Uh, and where the he's, he's in the hangar, so go to the other side of the hangar and then go out from the hangar. Hey, um, Pi! Nice! You won the battle royale! Must have been that Corsair magic, you know. First game was doing a lot more damage than anything else, and then it kept healing itself too. What's up with that? There's med packs that fall on the floor, Rez. Jesus, why the fuck? Why aren't you in there, Rez? Oh, you are. You're the carrot. I see you now. <laughs> I can't wait till you can. I can't wait till you can play pool. Yeah, that'll be good. Wait. That's not a carrot, that's the 600 guy. Oh no, the carrot was behind the 600 guy. <laughs> Tripping myself out. Oh, Jesus, I'm in the fucking toilets, where the heck am I? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't follow my vague instructions. <laughs> Fred, the other run, way, so... run to the front of the ship. Both of you guys <laughs> run to the front. Yeah, go back oh, cool. to the hangar, right? You yeah. see me now, yeah? Yeah, okay, come, come, come. <laughs> I don't want I don't want to worry you here, Fred, but this is small compared to my javelin. This is small. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> compared to my javelin, yeah. But this is the same, remember we had that mission on this ship? So this is the same uh, layout as in that mission. So if you wanted to wander yeah. around and explore, work out where everything is, it's a nice chance to do it without people shooting at me. At least until yeah. I get bored. Oh, <laughs> <And>, uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, uh... I run around a bit. Oh, I see the elevator. I, I think I'll. Uh... I go the wrong way plenty enough. I'm in the kitchen now. <laughs> <laughs> you guys. <laughs> uh, At this rate, Christmas is doomed. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to the me? bar. I'm going to the bar. But you don't have to wait for me. I can come after you guys. Oh, yeah. But you'll probably be back by the time I found the cockpit anyway. Uh, Have to be a bit careful taking off here because I parked us under a bridge. <laughs> yeah, I found it. Oh, it looks like the hangar's just gone down. Fred, would you be able to run to the hangar so you can send it up when Leslie's ready? Oh yeah. Oh, look at the look at all the dust getting kicked up by our thrusters. That's cool. The hangar, the hangar, the, the flight hangar, hangar bay. Yeah, yeah, the flight hangar. Uh, if I can find it, huh? Right. Yeah, right at the front there. of the ship. In fact, I'm just gonna. I'm just going to wait here for you, Leslie. We shouldn't hit the bridge. We should be clear for a straight up. Straight up. I love this ship. I'm going to be sad after the wipe when I don't have it anymore. It's going to be like butt spot leaving all over again. <laughs> yeah. Painful. Uh, I still on. don't I know what happened to him. My match is yep. sad. Yep, bottom level. Let's see, is that Aurora that was just called Triangle Box still here? It is. See, I think that's Butt Spot. I have a sneaky suspicion that's Butt Spot and something strange is going on. 
Oh, that's not Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Practice. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna send you a video after stream tonight, Fred. <laughs> that shows uh, the Javelin and the Idris next to certain other ships, such as like the 890, the 600 iron stuff, so you can see yeah. the size difference. Is it, oh. it shows you like a caterpillar next to the Javelin and stuff, it's hilarious. <laughs> it's actually hilarious. <laughs> really? Yeah. The Javelin looks like a little maggot next to the Javelin. <laughs> <laughs> like a teeny little worm. Bizarre. <laughs> uh, where am I now? In fact, I'm oh, going to go find the link I see the, now. I see the centurion. Uh, and you are at the other end of end. the ship. Yeah, turn around and go all the way to the other end of the ship. Cool, okay. blimey. YouTube knows what to recommend me sometimes. <laughs> I just log in and like one of the first things on my homepage is like, Woman addicted to butt injections. <laughs> That's just a big butt in the thumbnail. Yeah. Yeah, I'm in the hangar now. <sighs> Finally. Very cool. I'm just finding this video for you to watch. Uh, what yeah, do I do? One. Do I need to open it now? You need to you open can. it now, but you can. Oh, the hangar, you mean? Yeah, open it now. And then the video I'm sending for you to watch for the capital ship size is in right. public chat in general stuff. All right, I'll check it out. It has like a couple of different ships in it, but you'll really see uh, the size. Well, I fucked up. Uh -oh. <laughs> what Don't worry. Do? I just went the wrong way. Sometimes it happens even to me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, more, more often than I care to admit. Oh, I'm I, I'm opposite of the bridge now. Oh, that's cool. I'm yeah. I'm waving at you guys. <laughs> <laughs> and even the bar, like if you run forward from where you are, that's where the bar and conference room are on that floor. Okay. So the window you'd be looking in would be into the conference room. <coughs> that Corsair avatar is actually dope. It should be way longer, I guess. But hell, if I make that bigger, then this is going to be a massive sale across my whole <laughs> stream. Oh, and there's this black thing in the front. Yeah, that's the Corsair. No, uh, on the ship, I mean, I'm all the way in the front. Oh, that's front turret. Oh, okay. Yeah, so you get, when you're in the hangar, if you run towards the front, there's like an elevator, and that will take you to the front turret. Ah, okay. Cool. Imagine a turret that needs its own room. <laughs> <laughs> Coming back, guys. Okay. I'm gonna see where the mission is. Luminaria present delivery. Free gifts at SMO13 on Microtech. Okay. Sharing our first Luminaria mission, boys. Got it. Got it. It's not good pay, but it's festive fun, you know. So we'll sacrifice the big payouts and god knows it'll be interesting if we have to deliver to a landing pad locker with this bloody ship <laughs> i mean that's why my ship is on top right yeah that's why we have the uh, 100i just in case
another 100 eye over there. Is that you? I'm still not at my ship, but shortly. I guess that is you then. <laughs> Yeah, I like these missions though, because when you pick up the box, you know how normally it says like, deliver parcel 98765, blah blah blah. This one just says like, the package will be like, for Lindsay, <laughs> yeah. for Bartram, or whatever bloody name they choose this time around, you know. Uh, I, I like these missions yeah, last year yeah. too. I didn't see them last year. I didn't ever. I didn't look particularly. You know, I know you had the like picking up the presents off the floor, but I didn't know there was a mission to save Christmas. Hey, you always can find new things. Yeah. Here comes Leslie. That looks so cool. I've got you targeted so my vision like kind of follows you a little bit. Ugh, this wine is so strong. <laughs> it's been sat on my windowsill, like not open mind you, but closed, but it's been sat on my windowsill for like two months. I swear it's got way stronger because they don't usually have this much kick. Find the right place? Yes. Uh, strafe to the right a little. Oh, that'll do. Wait, I'm gonna go forward a little bit. No, it's okay. Okay, we can go. Okay, once I see you retracted, we'll take off. You all got the uh, Luminalia present delivery mission, right? Yep. Fred, bring her in. Moving down. Good. I love the third person view as we're taking off. Like, those maneuvering thrusters really kick up the dust, the snow here. That's so gorgeous. Okay, off we go, boys. So, Fred, you want to you wanna try out that front turret while you're down there? Remember, just keep uh, heading to the front of the ship. Yeah. Take the elevator I'll... up and have a look at that if you like. I know you like your turrets. you're in pie and the one to the left have remote turrets the one you're in has uh, lasers i believe and the, the seat on the left has uh, four remote missile turrets i've got the best view of the ship <laughs> Fuck. especially when i look back look does it actually that, power yeah. on because before i had problems powering that one on yeah no problem just push the push the, uh, the power on button and it worked. This is cool. What guns uh, you got on there? Um, M6A. Okay, so you got a size 4 cannons on there. 
He's a size five, I think. M six A is size five. Size yeah, the right. M6 ones, you always take two off the number. Oh, yeah, yeah. Wow. <laughs> this is cool. The 890 is like 33 million, roughly. Someone gave me 40 million on my birthday, so I was just like, well, I don't have anything else to buy, so I guess we're getting an 890. I have a 600i. Nice. 600i also, yeah. I love it. So we wanted SMO13. If I can find it. Where the bloody hell is it going? Oh, I see it. Shibin mining facility SMO-13. gonna untrack and track the mission a few times because I don't have a marker. You don't have a marker. No, me neither. Okay, I believe I do now. So there will be three packages we have to collect, which is why I initially thought the mule would be a nice idea. Yeah. But it doesn't really matter. We can fit three packages in the Centurion worst case scenario. Yep. Or we can just carry them. <laughs> <laughs> Do I get paid extra for carrying? No. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> this is a cool view. That's in the, the station, the space station. This is cool. view you got in this turret uh, is, is excellent you can check yes. everywhere first is beside me <laughs> How does it fly the 890? Yeah, it's alright. For a ship its yeah. size, it flies remarkably well, to be honest. Okay. But it is a big old girl. <laughs> uh. They're just shitting the screenshots. <laughs> Okay, we're 20 clicks out, so we need to make a decision. Are we landing there or landing a bit away and taking the Centurion? There shouldn't yeah, be any... The Centurion is not really a transport vehicle, so... Yeah, there shouldn't be any turrets, but I mean, we can do it if you want, boys. I mean, we could even yeah, land here there. if you want and ditch the Centurion for a, a rover and a mule. Yeah, I got both. I got a rover and a uh, I only got a rover. So I just thought the Centurion would be good if we didn't have anything else because it's got defenses and space, yeah. you know, but a rover and a mule would probably be better. Wow, look at these mountains as we're coming in. Yeah, beautiful. That's beautiful. Through the cloud. Yeah, looks cool. I, mean, I don't really have frames per second, maybe five, but it's still. Oh no, it just. Oh. Wow. It's only the shadows. Strange.
standing on trees. I think it's fine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. My camera's gone much? weird. How much? My camera's gone weird. Like, I was trying to turn and it was just making me look. Like, like <laughs> I was holding F or something when I wasn't. Let's say it's on the pad. <laughs> Pretty big. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect landing. Agents <laughs> <coughs> Right, let's see if we can uh, refuel in that and then we'll we'll grab the centurion off and replace it with a mule and over. Yeah. What's that big live stream avatar ship? The 890. Is it? Yes. Oh. Who has it? Me. You don't have uh, that. I do. You only have it in game. Yes, but it's my stream, so I could do what the fuck I want. Are <laughs> <laughs> you breaking your own rules? <laughs> this is him, even if it's in game. Yeah. I freaking captain, so I can do what I want. <laughs> it does look nice, doesn't it? Some of the models look yeah. really nice. It's, like the Idris looks really bad. Let me show you the Idris. Doesn't really look like the 890, does it? Does it? What's that turquoise stuff in the top? That's the glass, Liz. But look, check out the Idris. <laughs> it looks so weird. Is there... Is there a bomb there? At least it has a signature rail gun. Yeah, just about. The Kraken is my... Well, I say my favourite. My favourite's the Jab, but the Kraken has a really nice model. Look, look at that. That's so detailed, isn't it? Wait, you should keep that one. Why? I have a javelin. It's the it. Kraken. But I have a javelin. Javelin's not cool. The Kraken is. What do you mean? The javelin is 100% cool, Riz. The chorus air is the Kraken coolest. Is... What color is your javelin, Riz? <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, it would be pink if I had one. But I'm using the 890 today, so I thought I'd do something you know different what? from just using the jab all the time and go out a different The real aspect. question is, how I've many heard... torques would it take to kill your javelin with my Polaris? See, people keep saying that, like, I don't have fucking 15 turrets to shoot down incoming torpedoes and 36 size right. 12 torps of my own. But if you can hit with them, your ship moves like... Probably. And you think your like Polaris is going to be Mr. Nimble, do you? <laughs> yours. Absolutely. I'll be flying circles around you, buddy. That's okay. Fly circles. That just means I won't use all the ammo on the left side. <laughs> Fly as many circles as you like, Riz. You keep thinking your javelin is invincible, but it really won't be. Not invincible, Riz, but if you think they're going to make a $3,000 spaceship get one shot by a Polaris, you're going to be sadly disappointed, oh, aren't you? Oh, for the planets. 3000 so... The I have to go. I'm shot. going through the planets. Uh -oh. What the hell? The 890 isn't yeah. two shot, though. You can't two shot an idiot with a retaliator. What happened? Um, you can. I've done it. I, f I fell oh, through the planets. I made an idiot. Why? I don't know. I, an Idris I, takes I, I like at least and six and torps, down. and an, a, a javelin is going to be stronger than an Idris. 
Let's you cannot. You, you have not taken down an eight visit. Oh shit! We just did it. We just did it the other day. Yeah, but we'd already shot that to shit with a hammerhead fully loaded no, 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 no. and the course there. I was not the one. I was not the same one. That was a fresh one. <clears throat> but we we were all shooting at it at the same time. I think you are right. You need six torps to kill. Yeah, if you're solo, there's no way you're taking out an idris with three torps. Unless they massively Maybe nerfed five. it, because like it used to take me a lot with my retaliator. May might be able to take it with five if you're like if you can manage to hit it like on the one shield face every time maybe three torps uh, but like just uh, yeah because one one torp will take off the shield not on Two torps will definitely kill it yeah it will it was. i was there yeah one shield face They've is done with one torp because it didn't when i had my tally three would just about take the shields down and then your second run with your next three would would get it if you were lucky but i mean we did this yesterday so, uh, I'm talking about when I had my tally res. Like 10 years ago. Not 10 years ago. Oh, <laughs> spawning back on the shit doesn't work because I'm in uh, New Bennett's. Oh. Well, shit. Underestimate the tally. I don't underestimate the tally. You all underestimate the javelin. The, the... the javelin doesn't exist. Exactly, so why are you all like, I'm going to three shot it, like you have no idea what to expect. The oh, only clue yeah, we yeah, have is the javelin tour, where the woman on the thing literally said, this ship is so capable that we take it out without escorts to function independently. And everyone goes, I'm going to three shot it with my Polaris. Well, I don't think don't you are that, at Eric. all, Rez. <laughs> you know what? We're going to three shot it with three Polarises. That's nine torps. Yeah, if you have the whole fleet of Polaris, you probably are going to take down a capital ship, given that's what they're designed for. But you saying, I'm going to come with my Polaris and fuck up your javelin, is just a mistruth, Rez. We don't know that <laughs> Polaris doesn't exist either. Yeah, exactly. It could be the most amazing ship in the game, you know. Could not, though. Could. <laughs> you have no idea. So far, it's a Carrick with big ass talks. Let's watch both of us need an actual crew gallery, member so. to be in the talk room to actually even fire the talk. So neither of us will even have pilot weapons. And then we'll both be crying, won't we? <laughs> am I, am I <laughs> still in the party? I just end up ramming each other and. Okay. Well, who's going to win that fight, Rez? A javelin or a Polaris? <laughs> <laughs> I'll say that to a uh, cargo, Argo cargo ramming a. 890 or, and killing it, you know, and they both explode. I put gallons on my Corsair yesterday and, and they just shred. They just shred everything. Well, ballistics are going to be even better next patch as well because they'll ignore like 80% or something of the armor. I can't remember what the number is. Alright, well, I'm gonna go play some snow runners. I'll catch you guys later. Okay, Ray. Bye. 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 I can't wait to get my job and then approve all the haters, welcome. Yeah. I don't think I'm in the party because I you are. can't see your names anywhere. You, I am, yeah? Yeah, I just all checked. Right. You're definitely in the party. Uh, fly over to Shubin Mining Facility, SMO-13. Okay. We'll be here. So cool coming out of the airlock on the 890 and being able to run around on the roof. I wonder if yeah. I can... I wonder if I can... call the cutter at this pad over here. No. If it's small enough. It's no. not? It's not. I mean, you can try. Because oh. I was, like, impressed with how small it was. For, like... <laughs> yeah, 
for Samara, a gift for Haruto, and I think Leslie's already grabbed a gift. Yeah. Oh yeah, I see your name, Fred. 1,720 kilometers away. Oh, I'd have to claim it. I can't. I don't want to claim it. I don't know if jumping off here is a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like no. Got a vehicle in it. I don't want to claim it. Are there any more brothers to grab? Oh, yeah. And then you can drive us back because There's I have I, ha I have have to leave for this two or three minutes. 300, it's three hundred so three hundred meters right away. There, Is that right? Yeah. Which one are you going for, Haruto? Mana. I think Leslie's got the gift for Mana. Okay. Oh, okay, I see it. I didn't see it before when I was going there. But yeah, the boxes are all wrapped up nice and everything. I love these missions. I'm going to send up the cargo ramp until we're heading back. Uh oh. <laughs> well, one of them. Are you at New Burbage, Fred? Yeah. One of our deliveries is at a landing pad locker in New Burbage, so we'll be heading to New Burbage sooner rather than later. All right, I'll wait it out here. You'll want to be in a ship so you can like fly over to the rooftop, I guess. But yeah, I, I picked uh, the Aurora. All right, nice. <laughs> Okay, let me get in as well. Yeah, Luminalia packages. But I got no mission uh, accepted now. I don't know, share it with you. Uh, Sharing. Once we're back at the ship, I'll hop out and lower the elevator. Okay, let me jump out quickly. There we go. Cargo bay should be coming down any moment. so it doesn't clip into the ramp. There you go. It's gonna go up. The Ursa is so cool, I never used to like it, but it is pretty cool. Forward a little bit. Okay. 
just so you can get out the back way without problems. I'll stand here so just don't hit me. <laughs> Perfect. What I might have to do, well, we've got Leslie's craft to take boxes down to the landing pad anyway. Yeah, we're on board. We just gotta wait for Leslie to get back to get off the ship, but I think we can leave. Yeah, Fred's gonna meet us in New Babbage, so we'll go, we can take off. Leslie's here, just AFK, he'll be alright. Bye, Centurion. <laughs> I tell you what, as you know, we will. I was going to say we could go drop off one of the other gifts first, but then I remembered uh, Fred's waiting. So we'll head up to this OM point and then we'll head to New Babbage to deliver. See whose parcel it actually is at New Babbage as well. It will be Haruto. His gift is at the landing padlock of a microtech. Okay, I'll, uh, I'll park up on the uh, hotel already. Oh, good. See you guys coming. Yeah, I won't be able to land on the landing pad, so we'll have to use the snob to deliver that one. Yep. Night has got a big old atmosphere. Being over now. you mean <laughs> I to park on the roof but it's it's blowing me off oh you can't park on some roofs only ones yeah with yeah yeah. Pads. yeah 
Yeah, it's got a landing pad on top of the hotel. There's too much wind. Oh, we're, we're now approaching the landing pad we need to reach anyway. I think we're like a couple of K away from you. I can't see your, your names, so that's strange. Can you see the mission marker? No. Try on tracking and tracking. Because why well, can't we make a party? Because at the minute, because I need to hover over the thing. <coughs> see the mission markers yeah now I see you guys yeah. can't tell if my lights are on or not the good thing is it's it's the building with uh, two two buildings Sweet. next to each other so whatever one we don't have to land on you could land there and then Leslie can pick you up yeah. I don't know if Leslie's back yet or not. He, he wasn't when I left him. I have the box to deliver. Okay, can you go to the hangar with I'm it? I'm going to the elevator. No, go to the hundred eye because it's the thing is it's on a landing, but it's on a roof, so there's no way we can land there. Okay, I'm in the, on the hangar. Do you want me to take the hundred eye, or is someone gonna fly the hundred eye? Uh, yeah, you'll you'll probably have to do it. I didn't know if Leslie was going to be back. Oh, you are back. No, no, I'm back. Yeah. We've reached the uh, landing pad locker at New Babbage drop off. Uh, the package has been taken to the one hundred eye. Good. But we haven't. A Hercule, me Haruto. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to fly it down there? Uh, no. That goes I can. Fly. Go for it, fly. But, <laughs> but we need to pick yeah, uh, Mad Fred up as well. He should be on his way to one of the. Uh, um, uh, I'm I also. Can someone open the hangar for me? Oh yeah, I can. Okay, the ship seems to be stationary now. So Fred, if you you see there's those two buildings next to each other. The one on the left is where we have to drop Haruho's parcel. If you land on the one on the right, then uh, Pi can pick you up from there once he's delivered the package. Yeah, okay. Uh, I see more than two buildings. Uh, let me see. There's see two one. with landing pads, like they're identical right next to each other. I see one on your on your left side. Uh, no, they're like in front of us and to the right. They're like quite small. They've got big squares. Hey, on. there is a ship. <laughs> yeah, that's me. <laughs> oh, that's you. Oh, cool. But you see where Pi's going? No, in front of the ship. Now look down. And there's two buildings identical. Pi, I don't think that's where the drop off is it should be behind towards the back because I have seen it no, from the, the drop off is literally on the buildings directly in front of us on the left one really? yeah I've got the mission oh. mark oh. there's two little square buildings and the left one is the one with the drop off well, uh, is he going oh yeah 
Do you know what I mean? <laughs> There's two identical yeah. square buildings. You see them, Fred? No. Look I see the left. one below you. Look left. directly in front of where, where the ship is. Pie, pie is literally there now. Left, Fred. And there. Oh, down there. Ah. Yep. The two identical ones, you see? Yeah. So you might be able to fit on the same one as Pi, but if not, the one next to it, they both have landing pads. Is that from the end of it? So you can lay it there. And then there should just or, be a... I don't know what... I'm not sure what you're in, so... He's in Aurora. Oh yeah, there's plenty of room for an Aurora to land. And there should just be your standard admin terminal, maybe inside the little door, and then just drop off the parcel on that like normal. <coughs> Specifically put that not to come to visor chat. Oh, I'm blowing away. Fuck. If it still comes to visor chat, what the fuck? He's just chilling, <laughs> strolling carelessly. Oh, I'm so upset. There's not a little PTV driven around. <laughs> I'm actually worried. What if Buttspot never comes yeah. back? <laughs> well. Then we will remember, you know, the good times. Yeah. Interesting how the 890 has four thrusters on the bottom, but they are all at the back. I'm uh, just inside your ship now. Yeah, can you go into the door? Frost is having a hard time. <laughs> and then I can't find it yet. Door is closed. It's just behind you, I moved a bit closer. Uh, you might want to put the lights on because there's no lights on the pad. I mean, I am standing uh, near the pad, but. You got a torch? Whack your headlamp on, Leslie. Don't think that helps a lot. But there you go. Forward and forward a little bit more. More, 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 more. Absolutely. There, perfect. Yeah, yeah, good, 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 good. Perfect, okay. perfect. Okay, a little bit more forward. Yeah. Just, just a meter. Okay, cool. Yeah, the engine's off and bring her in. Lovely. 
The other one shouldn't be such a pain in the ass. Uh, so Fred and Pi were both on that ship, right? Yeah. Right, yeah. Cool, yeah let's get out of here. We have another delivery on Microtech itself, and then we have one on one of the moons. Our headlamps are crazy. They are strips. Which one? The headlamps. Well, my ones. Yep. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Before you might be okay, probably because he didn't answer. He answered just very quietly and mocked, like he's being I, kidnapped. I did not understand. <coughs> 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 Yeah, sorry guys, I was uh, I was AFK. <laughs> no, that's okay. Yeah, and my wife is going to bed, so I'll uh, probably um, set up downstairs so I uh, can keep on playing. All right, then, my dude. Right. Uh, so, um, yeah, I have to. Do you have to log out? Yeah, probably. Well, I can. I don't know if, uh, if I... There, there are beds. My, uh, you can try looking out in a bed. Yeah. I've done that before, but it didn't work. Um, might pick up the Wi-Fi uh, straight away when I pull the uh, cable out. Leave in this group chat, I swear to God. Every time they invite me to that fucking Racketeers group chat, I leave. And then fucking... They invite me again, and then it starts spamming up my chat screen. I've turned off. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, no, it's I not you. It, no, it's not you. It's it's every time, and I've switched it to not display in visor chat, but it still is. So it's like I'm just not joining that again, to be honest. <laughs> every time they do it, I leave and I get re-invited, and it's like I don't want to be in loads of group chats. I'm already in Discord. Hey, Fred is off. Yeah, I'm. Uh, Did you bed Moving long? downstairs. Yeah. Yeah, cool. Hopefully, I'll actually log back in in the bed. Hopefully. Yeah, otherwise, I'll if find not, you then again. You my bitch. <laughs> yeah. If not, we'll be at uh, a uh, mining facility SMO 10 delivering manners present. Oh. Okay, I'll. Uh, let you know when I'm uh, when I'm back. All right, dude. All right. it's not you, it's just that their stupid settings don't work. And no matter how many times I leave, I get re-invited to it. <laughs> it's annoying as well, because it always comes up as a party ring request when you get those invites, you know. So I always accept, like, oh, I need to accept the party invite, and then I get bamboozled back in there again. <laughs> Yeah, that's how I ended up in there. I thought they were your friends. Yeah. Oh, they are my friends, but I just can't be asked with that bloody group chat every time. Fire and keyboard and mouse, or is it? I've got keyboard mouse. I've 
play a joystick. Can you guys hear me? No, I yep. can now. Okay. Uh, what happens? Oh. CIG service connection timed out. Okay. Uh, we don't. Anybody's coming or should I do it alone? Don't mind. This is Mara's prison. Mana's prison, even. Never liked him anyway. No, just kidding. Good. We was watching this other uh, streamer, expat brat duties, and they had one that had to go to my girl three, like really far away. And they were yeah, using, that. yeah, they were using the nomad in it, and we were like, let's hope it's not a dog. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna jump out as well so I need to see if I can find support in that here. Be oh, right um, back. yeah. We didn't buy anything for your ship. I mean, there is beer in the bar if you want. <laughs> I can't get it out there, can I? Yeah, you can. Oh. I just put, put cargo boxes. Oh, nice. Into the ship, so everybody can get out. One is in the bar, the others are in the spool room where the elevator is. The others are in the spool room. Alright, I'll try to get a beer, see if that hydrates me. Oh, it just said Fred has left the channel at 890. Oh, really? Yeah, I'm starting up again. <laughs> I think you're going to be a new Babbage. <laughs> Bar. I'll level up. Let's see. Oh. Go inside the circle. It's nice not having to fly all the time. Like, it's nice flying every once in a while, like, just now and stuff, but like... Other side? There it is. Just nice. uh, that fuck. It's nice, it's nice just having, chilling. yeah. It's nice having someone else take the, take the, realm or take the helm. Is anyone interested in a uh, Caudillo helmet, ghost white? A white helmet? Hmm? Caudillo. I'll come check it out. It's the one with okay. the mohawk, okay. right? It's one with the mohawk. I 
can bring it back to you, no problem. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I think I'll get it. Oh, I tried to drink, but he hasn't put it in his hand. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, now he has. Oh, I have found water. So I'm bringing that too. Yeah, bring some water. This beer does not regenerate <laughs> my hydration very much. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm bringing... Do you need food? Uh, yeah, if there is some. I can bring four packets of food. I don't have a... You know, for this armor there is no... Um, you can always use the med bed if you run low on water or food. Oh, yeah. That's true, but... You know, the other one... It doesn't last uh, as long. It's better, yeah. Immersion! <laughs> you can roleplay a guy who just lives off the med beds. I did do that yeah. for a while. Yeah. Do you remember when <laughs> you I did that? You can roleplay that. Yes. I wasn't gonna get sustenance for food or drink, only intravenously. <laughs> <laughs> or rather, magically, because there are no needles in that made bed. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna bring some food. Yeah, I'm back in the ship, guys. Nice. Oh. It worked! Don't forget to set your spawn point again. Yeah. Uh, where's the door? Only the door won't open. Which door? <laughs> Which bit? The, cab the cabin door. Going? Yeah, yeah. Oh, got it. Yeah, it's working now. Okay, nice. <laughs> uh, uh, let me check where the med bay was, I, I, if I can remember. Leslie, you, you want to fly us to the last one? To the left? I can. When you have, uh, Sorry, I mean, God. if you're in a hangar, yes. No, it's fine. I'm, I'm glad. No, let's chill. I didn't mean I'm to, like, to kick your... you in the right. face, though. Okay. I was just leaping uh, around. Uh, the, oh, wait. Oh. I've seen that room before, the billiard room. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> If you see the billiard room, then go go out on the hexagon doors, like where I am. Hey, yeah, this way. The ship does really put into perspective, though, like how capital ships are really gonna be like uh, a mobile base, you know? Like, yeah. just think you could you it's, could easily have like 20, 30 people on here, and like this ship is you a could just FPS not level. even see each other. Here you go. Yeah. What box is that? Oh, that's the Cordillo, is it? Yeah, uh, we are desyncing, so I have no idea where you guys are sometimes. I'm in the I have hangar brought now. food, brought food and drink, I'm gonna put it in the box. Yeah, put them in the, in the box, in the bar. It'll be alright. Hi, the... Helmet is in the bar. Okay. <laughs> hey, the last gift for Samara. Hey, Samara's got hey, the beautiful Norwell wrapping paper we have too many fucking beer okay <laughs> i'm gonna bring the other box then which has leftovers i think this wrapping paper is so nice with the gold narwhals on i'm gonna sit on the mm. Which one is it?
what you're looking for. Oh, the box. Calliope Shubin Mining Facility SMCA-8 And they're getting the lovely narwhal wrapping paper Which is my favourite I would actually be so happy if I got a gift in this wrapping paper in real life So it's not having to fly as well because you can just take in the views and get nice screenshots. Landing here, Leslie. Oh. I was concentrating so much on flying. <laughs> <laughs> I wish there were different char flight characteristics. Like. Where your nose would pull down, or something, you know, like just little things like that, and to like let you know, like you notice in an airplane if your landing gear go down, you know. Yeah, what I mean? it does have that to an extent, I guess, but I know what you mean. It needs more drag. And then like hey guys, the spacecraft. We're we're, at the we're, we're in just leaving Microtech. Ah, okay, because I was about to hack my private set and put you some of the equipment. Where about? Are you on our server? Uh, yeah, we can hop on our server right now. Where are you thinking of doing it? SBK? Yes. Alright, once we drop this off, we'll head over to SBK. Copy. Right. We're in an 890, so we won't be able to do much but meet shield, but that'll do, wouldn't it? Let's get it's got turrets in that. Your server is quiet anyway, just 60 players. Okay, I'll be right back. Why do I need to be in a group chat? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We get summoned one way or the other. It's all yeah. right. <laughs> they wanted us to go hunting with them in a hammerhead tonight, but I just can't be caught with a crime stat. It's a little bit more interesting. No, it doesn't though. <laughs> it just makes it a pain in the arse. You, like, you had like an escort of 12 <laughs> fighters. Yeah, you but I still have a crime stat once those 12 fighters leave that I have to deal with. When you go to bed. Yeah, but then I, then I end up not getting arrested before bed. That's what I've come to realise. Because I used to love it. I'd be like, yeah, let's do crime before bed. And then at two in the morning, I'm sat there in global, like, will a bounty hunter please just come and fucking anyway, kill me? <laughs> could you just try, uh, fly to PO? But anyway, could you uh, pull my friend Opal down here? He's a racketeer too. And give him his clan tech and all.
He's in the lounge. Oh, yeah, yeah, I see him. Hello, Opal. Hello. Let me change your name. Let me use a party invite. Opal is in uh, Racketeer's channel in in game. You'll find him there. Rack. Uh, I'll just call you Opal. You can change your nickname sure. if you want. <laughs> Rose Starseed. There we go. Nice, thank you. No problem. Thank you. Ooh. Are you not in a party now then, Purple? No. Alright, bet. Invite and I'll make you leader. Oh, that's the wrong button. Apologies. <laughs> Man, that looks great. There you go, I made you With the haze leader. over the planet and like yeah. the set. It looks awesome. I made you lead a purple so you can invite anyone that needs it. Copy. Invite failed mining laser FPS. That'd be a little cloudy like that. I did not invite someone called mining laser SPS. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know anyone called Mining Laser FPS. You're my friend now. We're having soft tacos later. Hooray! We've managed to rescue three Luminalia presents so far. <laughs> it's been a slow, heroic day. But at least Naruto, Mana, and Samara are getting their gifts. <laughs> Are you all down there at New Babbage? No, we're at a uh, Shubin mining facility, SMOC-8 or something, on Calliope. Oh jeez, I thought we were landing because I heard weird noises, but we're still moving, aren't we? Yep. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> Lift, please! Oh god. <laughs> oh, this is unfortunate. I'm still, I'm still on the lead. Need some help? Come, come it, down. It's alright. I just, I exit, I opened the lift because I thought we had landed, but we hadn't landed yet. So I was just <laughs> stood on the lift as we were flying through the air. We have landed. Ah. Okay, back down we go again. <laughs> I really like this wrapping paper. I want yeah, this in real cool. life. What's on it then? It's Finley, the storm wall. Ah, yeah, cool. <laughs> okay, Leslie, can you start setting a route? To uh, SPK, please. Four. Oh. 
Oh man, what a day. Did you guys hear that? Sounded like someone on a loudspeaker? Yeah, that was purple with his voice changer. Oh, okay. I don't know if I still have it, but uh, purple just taught me about setting up a binding. So if you have like, uh, you know how like in game there's plus to push to talk, right? Yeah. So you set that as push to mute in Discord. So then you can use proximity or party chat, but then it mutes you on Discord while you're doing it. Oh. It always trips me out. <laughs> you just suddenly hear this robot voice. Like, what a day it's been. <laughs> we are the record here. Yeah, like that. Yard is shiver big bitches. <laughs> okay, Fred. I boys. am. I'm coming. I am the purple pirate. I just picked up some uh, some water. I thought there was someone like on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> like... What did you spawn, Opo? see the ants on the floor. Mm. <laughs> I tell you what, assuming uh, we don't get shot at by turrets, we could even drop the centurion on the landing pads there. That would be quite handy, I guess. We don't have a centurion the Oh no, we don't, do we? We have the rover. I am so sorry. Uh, for Opal, Opal, that's something. Uh, let's take something else. Let's take a butcher crew like Ducati. Then we can defend ourselves. I think the guys are taking longer here. Sure. We're now leaving the facility and heading to SPGO. Everybody on board? Yep. Oh, nice. Yep. Uh, <clears throat> what for? Oh, I'm glad I saw the belts on your, the grenade on your belt. That means I need to equip one as well. Red, do you want to head back to uh, front turret? Yep. I'm gonna head to the battle bridge. <laughs> battle bridge. I don't know where it is, Fred. Do you remember where the battle bridge is? Can't remember. <laughs> it's, uh, uh, it's where the kitchen is. It's definitely not in the bar where you are, Fred. <laughs> it's, where the, it's where the kitchen is. <laughs> I like the thinking, but I don't think I don't there's I, much in the bar. How do I power up the? Jesus Christ! The where the fuck am I? Uh, what's the front of the ship? That that's the front oh, of the ship. Oh, if you see me, power. that's the front of the ship. <laughs> yeah, where I'm at. Uh, to power up the uh, remote turrets, there no, should be a button on your. Uh, so if you like hold F and look at your hands, there should be like a little button on the right side, I believe. Damn it! I'm in the fucking swimming pool again. Jesus! How do I oh, get there? Go down another floor to have. The there's, elevators. Elevators. Yeah. there's two elevators outside the swimming pool on both sides. If I can find an elevator, fucking hell. <laughs> oh, exit shit, no, no. No, not no. That one. no not yeah. That one. yeah, I'm going. <laughs> That's bad because we are quantuming, so probably we are going to lose you. Oh my god. 
Oh my god. <laughs> if not, then come back up, okay? <laughs> yeah. You were at the swimming pool. How the hell did you get to that? I don't know. <laughs> oh, I made it. I'm going up again, hopefully. Come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Jesus, this this be... ship is a, is a freaking maze. It's not. <laughs> it is. <laughs> just have to get Come to me. Right. Yeah, I'm yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm up now. I made it. <laughs> oh, so. Oh, Ram is also here. Great. Who yeah. is flying oh, the I... ship? No one. <laughs> I'm not in the battle bridge yet. Well, oh, once I am in the battle bridge, if you want to take a uh, remote missile e? turrets, Leslie, that would be and helpful. Two what? Sorry. Once I'm in the battle bridge, if you can take a uh, remote missile turrets, that would be Hang helpful. Hangar, hangar, or... Yeah, hangar access is the floor we want. Yeah. And then come out the lift and turn left. I have to, I have to fly the ship. <laughs> Where's the battle bridge? Oh, I can fly it sake. once I get there. Kitchen. Okay, other side to where I am. I think it's that side. I mean, it's, it's in the middle, probably, or something like that. Uh, Just come this way, Fred. Yeah. And then your, your hangar's at the front. Your uh, turret's right at the front of the hangar. Is this the battle room, that billiards? Yep. Found it, Ram? No, I found some bathrooms. I keep looking. Okay. Coming, coming, coming. That's the fridges. Come, come where I am. Yep, and here it is. Ah. Your bottle room. So it's this back chair, right? Yeah, yeah, we got it. Oh, yeah, the bed. you can fly it from the battle room. It feels told weird not having yeah. windows. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if I like this. <laughs> you, have to use, you can only fly it with third person view. Alright. So, what's uh, targets. what we're gonna do now then? Um, what? What's your question, what, friend? What's, what's going on now then? We're we going to flying SPK to... to help Rack clear their crimes. Okay. Yep. Okay. So, uh, shoot anything that moves. How can I quantum from here, though? We are quantuming already. Yeah, but if I needed to quantum somewhere, I can't do it, can I? I have a new idea. I mean, you can Good. set a destination, but I don't know how you orient the ship. I never tried so flying you, the ship from there. So I guess you can fly it from here, but you probably shouldn't. Okay. I mean, <laughs> it, it needs some work, because flying blindly is not good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I just tried pressing B but it like didn't switch on a quantum UI or anything, so it's probably just the same as in the Carrack. When you're on uh, the top uh but the top you can see. Yeah, this yeah. you literally can't see. And you have a Yeah, but a you, heart. you can I just head to the normal cockpit, it's fine. I think we got a blue on us. From is it the left or the right? Uh, the left seat is the remote. Is the oh, the right missile ones, right and the right is lasers. Cool. Yeah, we need help. We have a lot of cops here. Well, we are 25 million kilometers away. Nice. And closing in, 24 and a half. This is an 890, you know. <laughs> There's not, not much we can do. Where the fuck How is early should I cut out to be able to walk straight to OM5? Because if I go all the way to Crusado, it's going to go janky, isn't it? I don't know. It usually does. Probably within 100,000. Alright. Cool. Just so I know, innit, I'd rather try and do the cut out early thing and save having to walk to bloody Daymar and back. I have four remote turrets, okay. Oh two. no, no, fuck me. Yeah, but what? Yeah, my, one. My, my game crashed in the middle of the fight. Ah, shit. Okay. 
So this is the top one. One bad thing about those remote turrets, Leslie, if you queue multiple missiles, so say you queue four missiles, right? It fires one from each of your four remote turrets. So when that 36 is gone, that 36 is gone from all of them. Oh. That's one thing. So it doesn't really matter which one I use. Yeah, I think it fires all of them if you're locking on all four. If you're locking on one at a time, I think it like sl it slowly works through. But yeah, I think the long and short of it is it doesn't matter which one you use. So pick whichever one you feel has the best view. And they shoot at the same direction? I believe so, yes. I just know that yeah. I always queued up because four it, missiles. You see, the interesting thing is that I can see the other turret from this one and it's not open. Because I tried to do... I tried them out on the Reclaimer, didn't I? Because I tried to do it solo. And, uh, yeah, I queued up four and every time I, I shot all the missiles and I was like, right, let's go to the next mobile turret and use their 36 missiles and there was just none Looking in any of them. So, dead on. I don't know exactly how it works, but it's just something that you should be aware of so you don't suddenly realize, oh shit, where's all the other turret right. midars? Right, right, right. <laughs> like I did. <laughs> Do not be me. Uh, Opal, are we still alive? Oh, yeah, I'm out. trying to knock you unconscious to rip you out of your chair so I can no, get the. No, don't, 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 don't. I'm holding back in, man. Oh, just unconscious. How did we survive against all those Fuck. police? Missiles are coming in. Yeah, that was my Take the turret and a pipe, man. I had a dream that, that something similar to this happened. I can't remember what ship I was in. But in the dream, I think it was Rez that was piloting. And I was in a turret and he was getting attacked in it. But he was like AFK or some shit. So I shot him in the leg so he fell out of his chair. <laughs> The ship is spinning way too much for me to hold lock and fire. You are two million out. Hey, Ram, you tripled your viewer account the last three weeks. Ah, uh, yeah, it's been going good, hasn't it? Okay, I'm back in. I'm back in. I got one Kati coming in. He's coming in hot. Ah, but her shit's up. Everything's what the fine. fuck? Oh. One more question, Ram. No, I don't want questions right now. I want solutions. I've just tried to set cancel route and set route so it wouldn't fuck up. And now it's trying to send us back to Microtech and then to Calliope. What do I do here? Okay, I think I Calliope, Calliope is at Microtech, so that's understandable. Uh, Ghana? Okay. Select selling. I've selected one of the party members, it's still trying to send us to Crusader though, so I'm just going to hope that it doesn't fuck us up on the OM point. If it does, then cancel and then we switch chairs. Oh, it's because we're not 100k out, we're a million out and I'm panicking. <laughs> Oh, we are almost two million out. <laughs> that explains it. This water. Wow, how tanky is this police cutty, please? So I don't know, but I've seen all shots connect. Can I ask my question? Yeah. Sorry, Leslie. So these are dumb rockets, right? They just go wherever I shoot. No, you can't lock them. I can't. Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there are more and more showing up here. Have you, boss? Have you considered getting out of the uh, this cutlass at the station and hoofing it? Yes. Where's the station anyway? That is for you to find, while I shoot them. Alright. Green, probably, right? Oh, we are jammed, oh my god. Yeah, so we need a bail at the station. Yes. God damn this school time. Yeah. It takes an hour just to... I 
they'll give us enough time. Okay, we get another cut, cutty there. Maybe someone's that, in the station. That's been there for a while. That, someone's in there, and they're yeah, probably but, wanted. It's parked it's underneath. Yeah. Now the cut throat. Oh jeez, I just realized the Vanguard's bigger than the coin. Jesus Christ, these avatars are scuffed. <laughs> Disembarking turret. That's sweet. Are we under the pets? Yeah, we under the pets. Well, we spool up and sort that out. We should be good. Side door is open. Oh, we should hide and wait for Rampage crew. They are about to come here. They're about to they're very close. Yeah, we're yeah, just spooling onto selling now. Attention. They're scanning uh, us. To scan your vehicle for security purposes. What are they going to find? Thousand bees. Yeah, 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 that's the only thing. <laughs> Stolen goods? Did you steal those beers? I've actually got crime committed possession of stolen property now. What stolen property? I don't know, but they said we should nick something and try to have us I have seen it, so probably I have the same, but I don't understand. It's alright, I just ran away. They didn't give us a crime start, I was too fast. Okay, open, what's the situation? It's how it works. Breaching. That'll learn them. Uh, wait a second, I'm right behind you. Please hold still for a while. Warping on you now. Yeah, Alright, boys, if it isn't purple or someone else, blast them out of the sky. Purple or opal. You should have party markers. Don't go too fast, man. You're not going to stop. Oh, he's here! He's here! What does that mean? He's here. If, uh, give me his position. Right where I am. And the computer room, yes. Is that oh, blue cutlass black yours out here? Or is that theirs? There's Which another. One? There's more. Oh, I read a uh, grenade got me. But I'm just incapacitated. There's three of them in there. Time for the Rampage crew to rescue us. We are here. They're rescuing me, only you. Oh, never and mind. You finished. That asshole finished yeah. me off. Fuck. We should take the we should take the uh, bounties. Don't shoot them, Fred. Don't shoot them. We currently don't have a crime stat, and they're they're all gonna shoot us if we do. They're about to we're about to get a crime stat because they want to scan me again. Opal is in Clasher. He's good. Uh, e EZO is in Clasher too. But thanks for the effort, you guys. Yeah, well, you're almost there. <laughs> we, can, we can come. I'm so sorry. We can come meet you if you want to break out. Nah, it's too getting too late for me. But what you could do is to kill the pirates inside there. I must have CS. I think we're going to have CS in the moment because we're getting scanned again. <laughs> let's, let's. Bomb away. Are you still trapped in there, Opal, or are you are you out? They're both Opal in prison. Is, Opal is in prison, but Opal is done for the night. Me I too, they been. executed me, these assholes. Okay, we're gonna run before they scan us. Okay. Somebody's still shooting at the station. It's a well, thank you, thank you anyway for the uh, fast response time. No problem. Sorry it wasn't faster. This thing takes an age to spool. Could have just waited five more minutes and take take you guys in there. I ain't having no scan. <laughs> yeah, fuck that. 
Or <laughs> the stolen goods? Maybe the helmet? Is the helmet I got the stolen goods? No, I didn't. Why would it be stolen goods? <coughs> you didn't loot anybody. <coughs> good night, guys. There were no dead bodies on the Have a good so night, purple. Yeah. Uh, I'm not. Yeah, I just wanted to ask you uh, are you going to move put pyro when it's on? Or are you going to stay in Microtech? Uh, probably stun him and then venture into Pyro. I'll roam into Pyro, but I don't really want to live there, kind of thing. You're a real Disney pirate, you know that, right? <laughs> yeah. I want to be able to do it. My plan as it stands is, like, if the game was to release with Stan and then Pyro Road, I'll basically probably be daily driving my merchant man around Stanton and then when I have the crew taking out like the hammerhead or the javelin to cause problems in Pyro, you know. That way I have a safe system to like store shit because the capitals as well, there's, there's talk that they won't be able to be like stored or put away, they're just going to be persistent like. So I want to leave them floating somewhere reasonably safe, you know. Hey, Joanna, how's it going? It's going. Slowly but surely, we're saving Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> We've delivered three whole presents. We're practically Santa Claus. <laughs> Imagine if Santa's sleigh took as long to spool up as an 890 job. Yeah. <laughs> Christmas would be a year long event. <laughs> Each day he'd visit a different house. But if you think about it with the 890, you don't even have to move the ship to reach the next 5 to 10 houses. Yeah. It's, it's just there. If Sano was smart, he really would have set healthy boundaries though and said, listen guys, every single house in the whole world in one night is a bit excessive actually, even for me. Can we stagger this monthly so we'll do the EU Christmas in December and then, then we'll do the Asian continent in the middle of March or something, you know? <laughs> North America can get their presents in August and then South America I don't know, don't they have their own Santa Claus in South America? They can just yeah. deal with that. <laughs> I mean, it's just strange. Good night, Purple. Good night. See you soon. Bye. Bye. Feliz Navidad don't need no Santa Claus. South America, you done fucked yourself. Santa's just skipping you now. We've got Europe, Asia and North America. That's where Christmas is. If you're not there, then I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Every other year. Yeah. It's your turn next year. I don't know why I'm, I'm chatting like that's a good thing. We voted to leave the EU. I wouldn't get no presents. <laughs> you guys not part of any of these continental powers anymore. We get Christmas on a leap year. <laughs> that's, uh, that's written so small that Santa can visit all the houses twice. Yeah, so, much, yeah we, we'll just wait our turn patiently. British people are good at queuing anyway. It'll be fine. <laughs> the Christmas queue. Be member left. I'm guessing that's that's purple. Wait, wait. 
I don't want to stir the pot here, but Opal is saying in global, I hope I scared you guys with the grenade. Wasn't it a grenade that took purple out? <laughs> Opal. <laughs> Opal left, didn't they? I think Opal's rogue grenade may have taken purple out. <laughs> And then they're just like, oh, yeah, they got us, boys. <laughs> That's hilarious, if so. That's actually too funny. Almost there. Yeah, let me just got another three months to wait while we spool. <laughs> I mean, we can just pick up a mission by we're arriving at Pipe Attack now. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully. What have you been up to today, Joe? Have you been playing chess today? Quantum fuel, 75%. I have a newfound respect for chess players, you know. I used to find it boring. My dad tried to teach me. I learned how the moves work, but I'm not very good at thinking ahead. I'm sure that comes as no surprise to any of my org mates. I'm very much, here's the situation, what am I going to do right now in the moment to deal with this situation, you know? Chess doesn't work like that. <laughs> I suppose it can if you're good enough at it, but I'm really not. <laughs> but he used to have an electronic chessboard. But it's Andrew Tate, you know. Everyone's probably groaning now. Andrew Tate gave me a newfound respect for chess players. Because his dad was like a champion chess player, right? Emery Tate. I don't really know who that is, but if you're a chess player, the name Emery Tate might mean more to you. It's Andrew Tate's dad, you know. That's how I know the name. But he was like a world-class chess player. And I can't remember like exactly what the details were, but the name was Emery Tate. I'll type it in the uh, chat for you. Emery Tate. So it's Andrew Tate's dad. If you don't know who Andrew Tate is, I don't know what rock you've been living under. <laughs> I'm not trying to be rude, but fucking hell. You can't escape him. If you watch YouTube shorts at all, you've almost certainly seen him. He's like bored. And he wears sunglasses and he goes, what color is your Bugatti? <laughs> He's a legend, but his dad was a, a world renowned chess player and an incredibly intelligent man. Like, So his dad basically had photographic memory, right? And basically he could remember, like if he played a game of chess, right? You could ask him afterwards to recount the game of chess and he would tell you all the moves that happened in that game, like in order, who'd moved what piece to what square. And he'll remember that like two years after the chess game happened. It's like, what the fuck? I can't even remember what day of the week it is. And you got people memorizing chess moves from two years ago? Fucking hell, man. Like... <laughs> Yeah, he, he's some crazy chess boy. We don't have any Luminalia mission, boys. What are we going to yeah, do? We can hunt four boxes on the floor. Uh, yeah, but what mission that, are we going to do? That's not mission. There is, there is a black guy to get. Ghost Hollow. Sharing. How about black kite? We could do black kite. Hey, there is a Luminalia. Oh, take it. I'm going to abandon that ghost hollow. Abandon the ghost hollow one. Sharing. Luminaria presence. Hooray! So the pickup is Rayari Deltana Research Outpost. Yep. It's the GMs that are really tough, Grand Masters. Damn. I saw a, a short on YouTube. I think it, I don't know if they were an international master or grandmaster. Like I said, I'm not particularly 
My finger is not particularly on the pulse of the chess scene, I must admit. But <laughs> I saw this short and there was this guy, like I assume he was some kind of master because like they had his name in the in the title of the short, right? Like blah blah blah, he's shocked by this. And they were getting ready for a chess game. And it was this Indian guy versus a, a, a like American or English guy, I presume, like of this white geezer. And they were sat down doing their moves and then like they each moved two paces, pieces and then just shook hands and like agreed on a draw. And apparently the story was that the the guy, the white guy, had eaten some curry the night before and it had like given him up that stomach. So they just agreed to draw instantly. And this guy, this master who'd come to watch, he turned up like literally just as the match was starting. Like he looked like he was running late. And he sat down, they moved two pieces and then shook hands. And then this this guy with the, the guy with the glasses, the guy I assume is the master, he's just sat there like, what the fuck did I just watch? <laughs> that was so funny. I found a newfound love of chess recently. Still not enough to learn how to play, mind you. <laughs> Who knew chess was such a thrilling sport? I still think the right. Video game companies, right? And and the, to be honest, the Chess Federation, is that what it's called? The Chess Federation in general are missing a trick, right? Everyone here, I'm sure, has watched Harry Potter, right? You've all seen Harry Potter. Why are you still making chess games? Just make Wizards Chess. It's so much more exciting. The pieces start beating the shit out of each other. It's great. And I mean, fundamentally, it's still chess, right? You just add an animation of the pieces battering each other. It would be glorious. But they never do. There's not been one wizard chess game made. Like, you get the auto chess battlers and shit like that, but they're not fundamentally chess, you know what I mean? They change the rules to some other bullshit. And then just call it auto chess. Well, I want wizard's chess. <laughs> When they make a wizard's chess game, I'll definitely learn how to play, because that'll be badass. Oh no! No! What's up? I think I just killed Fred. Oh no. Ow. In the elevator. I'm trying to find my way to, uh... <laughs> oh, Fred. <laughs> but that's okay. He's gonna still be on board. <laughs> I think we're both lost. And... Touchdown! Ship looks so majestic in the snow. Yeah. Looks cool. Where is Fred? So I don't think you killed him. Is everyone okay? Joe, wait till you see the missions we're doing. They're so cute. We're, we're literally gathering Christmas presents to save Luminalia. So all these gifts have just been left in this random facility. What? Hello, Leslie. Oh, you called it. <laughs> we have to go back for, for for fuck's sake. I was about to open the door for Fred. And now we are two levels down. Sorry, Fred. I'm going to send the Ursa Rover down. Oh! Try not to kill yourself, okay? I'm more worried about the rover, look at it. What the fuck did you do to me? I did nothing to oh, it. <laughs> fuck's sake. 
<laughs> All I did was lower the elevator. Something is not right here. Seems like the ship's blowing a little as well. Yeah, yeah. Uh oh. We are not down to the ground. Why? Getting pulled into Warhammer. What Warhammer are you playing? Dark Tide. Yeah, it's not exactly on the ground, but we can reap it. Oh, it is at the front. Oh, it is in the ground. Nice, I've heard that Dark Tide's really good. I used to play Vermin Tide. You too, Joe, have a good one. Save Luminar they are. It's for me. Gifts for Vale, Zara and Kenjiro. I want to grab the Narwhal wrapping paper. <laughs> I dropped my box and it put me on the roof. That's good. <laughs> I'm going to stay up here. <laughs> I see you, Leslie. <laughs>
<laughs> You're gonna wanna go from the front of the elevator. Yeah, I don't think so. At least not from this side. I suppose that's the only way they can set it to make rammers get crime stat, but like, what the fuck? It's a bit it's annoying. Stupid. I mean, they could they could get a crime stat if they kill someone. Yeah. So, my point is that I am not going back into the ship. In the car. Okay. Uh, do you want to go up on the elevator then, and I'll I'll try park? You can bring the cargo hanger down. Oh, Pi, you have to redeem those with channel points and then I start them. I'll give you one on the house though. for weapons P there we are I can't see shit yeah I think the buttons like underground can someone inside send the cargo lift down please it's, uh, very interesting Oh, Joe, you have to uh, do a redeem like Pi did, but I'll, I'll launch yours after this. Pi, you won! The Corsair is monstrous! Hey, <laughs> the rescue! Hell yeah. Okay, yeah, let's go. This is the one you redeemed, Pi. Yeah, I do them as channel point redemption, so they're not just like going off all the time, you know. I can't believe Bartsport isn't here. What happened to Fred? I don't know. Fred, are you bringing the uh, the All lift right. down? Something's moving. <laughs> Look at that little eight ninety. Rum. Yeah. How the hell are you going to get on the elevator, by the way? What do you mean? The lift's gonna lift the ship up like that. Oh, why, why <laughs> didn't they do it be before, huh? I couldn't open the ship, the elevator, because it was in the ground. That's why I was gonna go in the back elevator and then uh, lower it.
Okay, send this up. System off. System off. Look at these lovely presents. Thank you, Fred. Thank goodness, thank you, Fred. Don't be sad. Oh jeez, I need to drink. <laughs> yeah, me too. There is water in the bar. That's a good myth, but I'm right near it. Drink. Yeah, oh. I don't know, but... <laughs> So, where are our drop-offs? Landing pad locker of Microtech, Rayari McGrath and Shubin Mining Facility SMO18. So I guess we'll go do the uh, landing pad locker first. And the landing pad locker one, if you want to move the box into the 100i, is the gift for Zara. So the gift for Zara could do with being loaded up into the 100i, please. You want me to do that? Uh, sure. Whoever's about, really. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, fuck, fuck, see. Happen. <clears throat> I want to play some more food, so I drink. Oh, Eero's here. What was I going to give him? It was either the, yeah, Connie, and then Eero was the Pisces. There you go, Eero! Hey! You're a Connie no. now. <laughs> nice. And help my brother set the Christmas tree. Nice. Oh, this is going up. We see we there is somewhat like the nose falling down. If you don't pay attention, our nose is currently falling. <laughs> Which isn't ideal. Which gift? Hmm. Which gift am I moving to the? Uh... The one for Zara.
should be out of atmosphere at any moment and then we'll be down to New Babbage and then we've got to do it all over again <laughs> could be worse though it could be awesome so we should count our blessings really Go off to New Babbage. Those frames. <laughs> yeah, same here. I haven't noticed any combat beacons coming up tonight. There were a few. Uh, so I haven't really been particularly looking for them to notice, but... When the gift is in the... 100 eye. Awesome, thank you. We are... 14 clicks out from Zara's gift drop off. New Babbage looks so nice at night. Look at that chat. See, this is the thing with Star Citizen. For all the cries of it's a scam, oh, they're fleecing us with more concept ships. There is no other game that lets you play like this. There just isn't, you know? Yeah. <laughs> they could release the game. Like, obviously, we've only got one st system. But if they, if they fixed all the bugs that we've currently got, they could release this and it would still shit on pretty much every other space game I've played, at least. You know? Having a hundred systems would be cool in that one day, but, like... It's already breathtaking, man, and it's in alpha, like, what the fuck? As long as it actually reaches release. seconds arrow invite why are we falling why are we falling I don't know why, it won't let why me does pull the, up why does the beat bottle always uphold maybe topple over no, I mean coupled. Come on, pull up, you fat bitch. <laughs> did I, okay. Should I start praying? No, we're all right. <laughs> okay. Whoever's gonna deliver it, we are now one click away. We're like right next to the landing pad. So if someone wants to go jump in the 100 and drop Sarah's present off, I'm sure she would appreciate it. <laughs> Empire's already there, no? No, I'm back in the... Oh. I just moved the package. I have a nice right. view. I can see the landing pad, the hangar, everything. This is a lovely view. I thought someone else was going to fly it. I, it's okay, yeah. I'm going. I don't know about Fred. I mean, Fred can fly it if he wants. And we're right near Twin Sandwiches headquarters. 
We should go loot them, boys. Steal all the sandwiches. Actually, no, that's not very Luminalia spirit, is it? <laughs> Stealing all the sandwiches. <laughs> <coughs> to be fair, that's my Luminalia spirit. If you ever invite me to like a Christmas party or a buffet or something, you best believe I'm eating all the sandwiches. Normal people, they'll take like what they can comfortably eat, right? They'll take like a single layer on their plate. I take my plate and I mount in it. If, if the food can physically stay on the plate, it's not too much. Only when things start like tumbling off the sides and it starts getting embarrassing, do you know what I mean? And even then, you still catch the bits that fall off the side in your other hand because they're not to be wasted, <laughs> you know? It's a wonder I don't get invited to more weddings. <laughs> I love a wedding buffet. Just eat the whole lot. <laughs> well, hey, here it comes. Looks cool. still have a uh, gamma correction of filler on this. I should have. What? Well, I don't. That's kind of weird. What the fuck? I swear I put a gamma correction on my gameplay scene. Let me make it so you see how I see, chat, because, like, you can still see, like, it's not unbearable, but, like, this is more the colours I see. There you go. You got some gamma correction now. That's really weird. I guess it must like save the filters in each scene collection. So I've probably got it in like one of my other uh, scene collections. I'll have to try and remember to check that each time. Same, it's so cool, in it? And you can do this in hardcore too, probably. Yeah. The hardcore ones are arguably more impressive, to be honest. It's because there's so much more city around them. But Microtech's so much more Christmassy. <laughs> Has no and yeah. pine trees. Expat made these missions look a lot faster, but then she wasn't using an 890 jump. <laughs> <laughs> Are we getting rep or anything for this? Uh, we should be, yeah. We get, like, a little bit of money as well. Like, very piss-poor money. But I think these missions are more intended to be, like, you know, like, you get delivery box missions for your starter ships and that, that, like, literally anyone can do kind of thing. So I think this is on that tier of missions, do you know what I mean? Like, hey, yeah. it's Luminalia, everyone get involved. Even in your starter ships. Uh, it's nice. I, I just like how the boxes are all wrapped up and nice, you know. I think that's so cute. And these are only around at Luminalia, so. Yeah, let's try and get a nice cinematic view as we leave. Hooray! And hopefully we don't start falling backwards because that would be very unfortunate. <laughs> the younger die. It's gonna be so cool to see me walk outside now. Oh, this is trippy. I'm looking down on the city and just standing on the roof of the ship. 
this is local. Well, we made it. We're not falling downwards. That's a good <laughs> thing. Yes. Usually helps. So our others are actually not even on microtech at all. One of them is by the snake pit, so I guess we'll do that one next. An old snake pit, huh? And this is the gift for Veil. Might even land at the snake pit and we'll have a little Earth uh, rover journey over there. We'll see. <coughs> I can't believe the police tried to tell us we had stolen goods. Just so outrageous. We showed them though. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? They're like, hey, stop. It's like, nope. <laughs> I still don't have a crime stat for that. Your mic stopped working, Fred. That's not good. I do have in-game chat up if you need to type to us. You now recognize your authority over us. Well. Like they could even do anything anyway against an egg nightly. <laughs> I'll stop for now, you got a headache. Okay, Fred. I hope you have a good night. I probably won't be on hugely much longer. Well, actually, it's only 11, so I've got like another hour in me. That was so cool. light so that's something hello snake bit should we do a quick lap boys <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean quick this is an 890 oh yeah have you seen, been to the snake pit before pi so basically oh. if you look ahead of the ship you see there's like so you've got the drop-off location, right? And then to the left, you've got like that weird complex of like pipes and shit. Mm -hmm. That's the snake pit, and it's a it's a race track basically. There's like a lap you can do there. People rag their ships around there. It's pretty fun. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. And I have uh, now I have three videos. Yeah. And there is a fourth coming. <laughs> So you can watch Rumpface we'll do, do this with Reclaimer. <laughs> you can 
You can experience it with the 890 right now. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, there, yeah, yeah. In person. I have hit the 890 lap in within the the origin day video for nice. IAE. Yeah. So yeah, this is the snake pit that we're now uh, approaching. This is extremely tight in an 890 jump. It's made for like small ships like the Misk Razor and the racing ship. Yeah. But I like taking stupidly big ships around it that have no place being here. <laughs> oh, I'm going to release the full 890 video too. When I finish it. Thank you, Fred. It's been fun. I never have only done like two missions, but still, it's pretty fun. I like these missions. They're a change of pace. This is just chilling. Yeah, sometimes it's nice to have a change of pace in this game. Hi, Fred. See you, Fred. Thanks. Have a good one. So this is the start line here. Hey, landing gear. Landing gear's out. Yes. Yeah, I want it out. I'm doing oh, my okay. standard start. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> so I always start landed with the engines off, just so that like this the spooling up time counts during a race kind of thing. Yeah. It's just a nice way for it because we race like some people have different ships so like we did a race with a hammerhead a carrack and a caterpillar and they all have different startup times so it's just interesting to have everyone landed and engines off at the start then when it's on go everyone's scrambling to get their engines on and get off the ground you know uh, let's hope this time nobody blows us up yeah okay count me in let's leave Three, two, one, go. Come on, lift up. Lift, lift, lift. Hey! <laughs> oh, that's a bit much. Now, I may have misled you when I said racing because this thing sure as hell isn't going round here fast. But it is incredibly oh. tight and more of a like precision event in this ship than anything else. Yeah. It's a pretty cool little track. You can see you've got like pipes on either side to kind of mark where you want to go. I forget how big the nose is on this thing. Oh. A little bumpage. Yeah, I say this is this is the biggest ship we can possibly take round here at the minute. So it's very tight, but I like it. <laughs> I always forget I can boost sideways as well. So. This bit coming up in particular is very, very tight. Like in a reclaimer, this bit is so hard. This ship is not much shorter than that, so. No, I'm hoping it's thinner though. It is thinner. There we go, that was quite smooth actually. I get cool shots for the video. <laughs> This 
the remarkably smooth laugh. What the fuck? <laughs> Why can I never do this when you're filming? Oh, you are not finished. You're just halfway, so... And I am filming. Oh, no. Now he's... <laughs> <laughs> If you use your imagination and imagine it's like ten times as fast, you yeah. can imagine it's a pretty. It is a pretty intense racetrack. Like you got a hairpin here now coming up, which is always fun. There we go. <laughs> Here's the finish. There it is. There you go. You can officially say you've been around the snake pit in an 890 now. <laughs> Probably won't find many people willing to do that. <laughs> <laughs> that was remarkably smooth, though. It was. Right, let's go deliver these. Thanks presents. for the new footage. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> nice low fly over there now as well. Look how low we are. Jeez. Almost scratching the paint. 453 meter altitude. <laughs> Another ship here, is that you, Aero? Yep. Nice. Perfect landing. Amazing. <laughs> so, whose present is here? It's uh, Veil, Valley, no, Veil. Veil is present, is here. Veil, okay. Oh, I can't repair where we are. No. Not like that, you can't. Oh, I can. Aha! <laughs> Even better. Excellent. <coughs> Look at Eros little Aurora down there. <laughs> I see you, Aero, in your orange armor. <laughs> Are you coming? So should I wait for you? Yeah, yeah Aero's coming as okay. Aero's like by the uh, cargo elevator as well. So he'll be there as you go down. Realize he's going <laughs> the other elevator. <laughs> yeah, I'm going the other elevator. Okay. I'm at the front of the ship. Or 
minimum is shipping. Nice. So weird seeing you guys running around under there. <laughs> yeah. You're so small. <laughs> I'm gonna go look around for drinks. Good idea. Did you already grab the gift? No, I left it to you. Should be in the rover anyway, shouldn't it? Yeah, it's in the rover. But whose gift is it? Whales. Whales. I set a route to our next one as well. Hey, one bottle of water. Hell yeah. And some crews. Yeah, we'll do a cool emote. <laughs> I see you. <laughs> I like the third person camera. <laughs> I just see you on the landing pad pie sprinting over there. That's so funny. It really gives you a perspective of how long the ship is when you see people yeah. trying to run from one end to the other. One more water. Damn, that's really weird. You can like, at really, especially in third person camera, because I'm like floating above the ship. You can really see the draw distance, because like, as you guys were running away from the ship, you like started flashing and then disappeared. <laughs> like as you went out of the draw distance, you know. Yeah. I love this 890. I hope one day we can hire NPC pilots. Because just imagine how cool it would be to, for us to just be able to chill on the 890, right? And then you just like, you set your destination like you always do. But then like once your destination's set, an NPC captain just starts flying there, you know? That would be so good, and then we could just relax in the bar and <laughs> wait to get there. <laughs> I hope that is a thing. I suppose it's going to have to be, though, realistically, because, like, especially in other capital ships like Kraken, Javelin, Idris, you've got a command bridge, haven't you? So, like, the person in the pilots, in the, well, in the captain's seat, I should say, isn't necessarily the same person that's in the pilot seat, you know? Like Starfire, for example. Yeah. That's going to be weird. That's going to be so cool. I swear, if we have NPC pilots, I'm never flying anywhere again. <laughs> I'd just be like, Jeeves, take us out. <laughs> 
We get custom NPCs as well if we have spare game packages. I've already got names for a turret gunner. I'm gonna call him Gunner. Like, you know, the Swedish have the name Gunner, but it's spelled like G U N N A R. So he's gonna be called Gunner McTurret. <laughs> cool. <laughs> I can't remember what I I had a cool name for the medic as well, but I can't remember what it is now. It was really cool and edgy. God damn it. I can't remember it now. Everyone's back on board, right? Yes. Yep. Alright, let's set off. Oh, I think we were still refueling. <laughs> I've set off anyway. <coughs> It'll be fine. Go ahead, guys. So I could remember what the cool name for my NPC was gonna be. God damn it. made an engineer uh, NPC, I could call them Benji, and then have the last name Near, so their name would be Benji Near. <laughs> nice. Yeah, it was something like that, but for medical, and I can't remember what the fuck I, I, I it was now. It's really upsetting. <laughs> It was so good, and now I can't remember it. No! I suppose I could call them Cal Medi. Worst case scenario. I've put some more food and drink into the bar. Was we are now twenty five clicks from Shubin Mining Facility, where the last gift is. Hopefully, we don't have a contact. I assume it's just the rover or the one hundred I that keeps saying it's a contact, <laughs> and not a dead clips about to ruin all of our day. I can't believe the 890 takes three torps. I suppose the Tally does have more hull HP than an 890, doesn't it? Tally's got the most in the game. It's a bit weird.
Here's food arrow if you want. I get a bunch of cruise drinks. So I have uh, put two boxes inside the circle. Here. So if you have something excess, then you can put them here and you can find beer in these. Behind this door, there is 900 something more. <laughs> it was funny because uh, I just stopped and that was a coincidence. What was the coincidence? Uh, I was looking at my screen and went, okay, uh, there's a, an ashtray with a cigar in it, and uh, <laughs> our uh, target, you know, oh. gift for Kenjiro is, is right over it. <laughs> nice. Yeah, Kenjiro is gonna have a happy Christmas. I'll give him a blunt, bro. <laughs> Cutting down now. <coughs> I'm so good at landing on these tiny pads. <laughs> Anybody coming? Yes. I will come as well to this one. And Jiro is special. Yes. But you don't um, want to go out those side doors. I see the elevator <laughs> on accident. <laughs> you can. <laughs> you can, it's no problem. It's kind of nice walking out of these doors on the planet side, to be honest. If you haven't already done it, it's pretty cool. Just like running around on the roof of the 890. I'm gonna take the down the... Run through this aerodynamic thing. We can't jump off this way, we'll die, but it's pretty cool still. You can spy on people having a meeting. <laughs> It's pretty cool to be able to like run all the way to the front of the nose, you know, yeah. and stand here and look down upon all the peasants in the kingdom. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you could just imagine stood up here with your fancy clothes on, throwing credits off the side while they all scramble around on the floor, you know. <laughs> Oh, so I think someone just jumped off. Did you just jump off, Aero? No, you're there. Uh, Something I just hit the ship and fell off. I dropped the beer bottle. <laughs> That's how you're all. Wait, there's Leslie saving Luminario. Hey, Luminario he's fancy uniform. <laughs> <laughs> Kenjiro is a lucky man. Are you Kenjiro, sir? No. Okay. I wonder if you can, like, parkour up onto any other parts of the ship. It looks like you might be able to up here. No, it's too high. Oh, and the back feels very sketchy. <laughs> this is cool though, you can look into my captain's quarters. See my fancy fish tank.
Oh, hero. I thought you'd fallen off fully then. First I thought I did too. Oh. What if I get back up? I hope so, because I'm down there now too. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe this way. To do this on microtech, huh? <laughs> there is high gravity. Oh, yeah. I can see you guys there. <laughs> Arrow went for it. He's arrived, so oh. you can jump down, Ram. Barely. I'm bleeding. I'm inside the engine. I'm going to make my way down a little slower than that, then. Yeah, yeah. That's. <laughs> Parkour, that parkour. Right. There's one more level. And then into that big pile of snow. Hey! <laughs> I missed the pile of snow. Are you alright? broke my legs. Oh, we have a hospital on board. I can't use the gun here. It's okay. Is Pi back inside safely now? I am. Okay, good. I didn't want us all to get back here that they are okay. just like clinging to the side, like, <laughs> no! <laughs> you guys got back in? On yeah. my screen, you and Arrow look like you were possessed when we are using the elevator. Yeah, we are. So I fly these big ships around the snake pit so good. I sold my soul to the devil. <laughs> to the ghost of Benny's Henge. Choose between an 890 jump or a reclaim, my boys. It's okay. Uh -huh. I, I was I was expecting the boys to choose. <laughs> <laughs> so bizarre. Take the 890 to the 890. Then. I've probably got, we've probably got time for, well, we've got a half hour left, so I guess we can do both if we have time, but probably we've got time for like one more mission. So we'll share this 890 jump mission. It was basically just deciding whether we do the black kite or an 890 to finish off, you know. But I like to give people options. Okay, OM5 and enter the distress beacon. Everyone on board and ready to leave? Yep. Good. Go try to find the front turret. It's hangar. right, right at the front. So yeah, go to the hangar and then keep going forward. sit in the chair in the lounge Wait, we are doing the 890 yeah okay. did you did you get the contract i can share it again if you want please sharing in three two one sharing i did 
So now we'll go save the Luminalia party. Well, I guess not really, because they're all going to be dead by the time we get there. <laughs> but we'll at least save their precious data for being exported. Whatever the, the data thing is. Should be coming out of Atma any second. Okay, we've just got two jumps, OM5 and then to the distress beacon. So get to uh, battle stations, boys. <clears throat> Hopefully there's some cutlasses there to blow up. Although the last few times I don't actually recall seeing any cutlasses. Oh, the last time we did this, not yesterday, <laughs> there were. Did I turn up late though after the cutlasses were already gone? meters away <coughs> curious how these turrets work it's, it's, it's basically it's literally just a missile operator mode but in a turret uh, that's okay I'm just curious because you know I have no radar See the contacts, Leslie? No. I see how you like this. I see the missile coming at us, but I don't see too. any ships. <laughs> you see I see the, the 890. No, but I can try I see, one. I see them. No, I don't. It just doesn't seem Do you to. Do now? I can't target. Are you switched on? I don't know. I mean, it. Do I Do we have an on button somewhere? Because I didn't. Oh! Weapons I... active. Alright. Can you keep them low? I can try. Now I understand. But they are just too close for me now. Obviously. Flying in reverse, trying to keep them 
like level with us. There he goes. <laughs> Good job, boys. Yeah, I don't really. I'm not a big fan of missile turrets in general, to be honest. It, it was my fault. I didn't found the power on button. Ooh. It's just the thing with missiles in general. Like you can use them to open a fight, but once you're actually in the fight, missiles to me anyway become useless. Because unless you're gonna yeah. all all the time you waste trying to get out of range, you could spend just shooting them, right? So why not just stay in gun mode? That's my logic. I feel like they'd be way better if they were just loads of laser repeaters, really, instead of missiles, do you know what I mean? Because if you've got fighters or someone buzzing around you trying to destroy this thing, like, those missile turrets aren't going to do anything. They're not going to be able to take Could down at all. Could you roll to the right a little bit? Thank you. It's too much. Too much. Too much. Yep. Thank you. Just making a screenshot. Thanks. Go ahead. Proceed. <laughs> I have what I wanted. Okay, I'm going to pull up on the left side. It looks like the bottom is open. Can you just EVA in the bottom? Oh no, the roof would be closed with that lift, wouldn't it? Yep. I, I, I just bumped into him, so I probably got a crime stat now. <laughs> well, this is pretty cool. Okay, we are cool. here. We probably will have time for another mission. It's still like. It took us four minutes to get here, so we've probably got time. Got my gold pistol ready. I'm going to see if I can get some people through the roof of the hangar. <laughs> Wait, I have grenades, right? No, I don't. No! <laughs> the arc light's terrible. Okay, I can open the door. My arc light just doesn't hit these guys, but they can shoot out at me. What the fuck? <laughs> That's brutal. I'm just incapacitated. I'm on the way. I was stupid. Oh yeah, we need to do the data transmission as well. What rooms have we checked? I was about to check the gravity generator, but I'm gonna check the bridge quickly. 
It's on the bridge. Found it. Thanks. Did you kill everybody? No, there's no, still no. Left. Oh shit! Okay, I'm down <laughs> again. <laughs> uh, he was behind us. There you go. Get your back up. There's two more in that hallway. Uh, they're down. That one is not. Or oh, maybe he is. And there, there no, are people. Lift here, lift here. There were oh. many people downstairs in the right engine room. I'm gonna go down. We're now there heading down to engineering, so we may see some people as we come out of this lift. Shit! Oh, this no. is not my day. Is that the guy? I don't know what. Nice. This is not my gun. This is not my day. <laughs> Get ahead. Very nice. Did you kill them? Yeah, we got them all. Cool. Good job, uh, Pi. I need the medical. Or yeah, me too. Way. I have a pen. How do I stab someone else with a pen? Uh, I think you have it out and then right click on them. Let me try on Leslie. Leslie, stand still. Yeah, uh, that bitch right here. It's so not letting me stab. Oh, okay, you good? You good? No, it, it does. Nowadays it doesn't work. I don't know why. Stop worshipping me. <laughs> <laughs> Strange. I still have the the gun in my hand, but I don't have the gun in my hand. I mean, I, I have the indicator on the. Yeah, if I want to. Someone just it. said they're gonna go hit the racetrack for a bit. Dominate a 5k. <laughs> We should go race them, boys. <laughs> With what? 890. I mean, he has what? <laughs> Don't know. Well, not very much when we finish shooting him with the 890, will you? <laughs> mm. I do find stuff like that grease, though. Guaranteed that Dominate is the same <laughs> kind of person that will now get killed at the snake track. And then they'll be straight on Reddit, like, I can't stand these griefers. <laughs> it's like when you literally told everyone where you're going, bro. Like, what do you mean? <laughs> where do you need assistance from? I'm just uh, curing my tier 3 leg injury. Oh. I didn't do it on board, I would. I figured I'd be brave. But the pain's getting too much. Mm. Yeah, I'm drunk. I have a tier three chest injury, and I am <laughs> not well. Today's been good, though. It doesn't feel like we've only done bloody three missions, does it? <laughs> Maybe it does to you boys. I've had a great time tonight. Time's flown by. So I mean, when I look down at the time and I was like, shit, it's 10 o'clock, we only did one one of these missions. It's like, it was fun the whole way through. Like, I wasn't saying it like, damn, it's taken us till 10 o'clock to do one mission. It's just like surprised that it's so late, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. I feel like we've only been playing for like an hour or two. We've been on for nearly five hours. This doesn't finish? Never? What? It says healing in progress, but it doesn't... Uh... It does once your food and that's full, I think. I, I was okay for half a minute. It wasn't okay. finishing. I don't know. I have probably other problems too, so maybe a reload. But I guess I'm not going to reload. Who's <laughs> come along and took all the helmets off the NPC? Uh, I took one of the helmets. I just come through and there's just all these bodies <laughs> with random boxes <laughs> near them. <laughs> I took two helmets. I want to look in their cold, dead eyes before we leave. <laughs> 
Can we actually send this elevator down? Because that would be pretty handy. We're all here already, after all. No. There's a load of shit in it. Very unfortunate. Maybe. maybe. No, this screen do not work either. Uh, look at the guns just floating in the sky. Nothing works, Rob. not even local inventory here now. I swear before you could like store stuff in the 890s yeah, local. Yeah, that, that, that's true. Wonder if we can send this one up, no? <laughs> oh, there's another turret here in the hangar at the back. Yeah, there's Where's a button one. Oh. Uh, that's probably why I ignored it all these years. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the ship's so annoying. Like, if you go down the wrong side, it's just like, for fuck's sake, having to run a whole lap of this thing. Here we go. Just take a left and take this ladder. <laughs> It is bad though, when a couple of ships come out, like, I'm probably going to have to rely on everyone to know where they're going. Because I'll know my way to the captain's seat an hour again. Just like the caterpillar. That's a shame. I can't remember which, I think it was the caterpillar, there was a whole room that I like didn't even know was there. Actually, no, it was the hammerhead. It was the hammerhead, the upstairs in the cargo bay. Oh, yeah. You know, you got that, like, viewing window. I never even yes. knew that room was there. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's exciting, though, because one day you log in and then you find the secret room in your ship that you've never seen before. And it's like, wow. <laughs> Where you find out that the 300i has a secret cargo bay underneath that you never knew about. <laughs> <laughs> that was a big day for you, right? That was. Oh. That was the day I actually started liking Oregon ships. Now look at me. And now you have <laughs> Obviously, if there were a bigger one, then you would have that one, probably. Yeah. Okay, so I guess we'll do this one now then sharing 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 this is another fun one boys And this one you get to blow something up at the end as well. So I'll probably call this the last one for the night. We'll finish with an explosion, uh, go land at New Babbage, and then we'll call it a night. Cause it's, well, it's quarter to midnight here. I know, Pi, bless you, you're probably like five, six hours behind. <laughs> like, okay. damn, bro. The night uh, is young. I gotta play, I gotta play hours. To be fair, what even is your sleep pattern, Pi? Because I swear half yeah, the time bro, I wake like... up in the morning and you're already on bloody Atlas or something. It's like, bro, did you even sleep? <laughs> yeah, I, s I sleep when I sleep. But yeah. I do sleep. That's like me. I'll stay up all night till like 7 in the morning and then I'll sleep for like 13 hours till the night time. <laughs> Quite fucked up though, because if I lived in America and just kept my sleep pattern, my hours would be perfect. I'd actually have a normal life. <laughs> I'd be falling asleep at midnight and waking up at, well, probably still around lunchtime. <laughs> at least it's more normal than waking up at 6 p.m. 
<laughs> what chip should I buy? I'm gonna go chip shopping. Ooh. What are you looking for in a ship? I don't know. That's Something what ships gonna make have? it tricky. <laughs> I have... I hope it's a ship. Have, it's not. <laughs> then, then, what ship don't? You don't. I was thinking about getting, like... A Shrike. Shrike I don't know. Nice. Something, something fun. Something fun to just... But the Shrike is good for... Missiling. Yeah. There's smaller guns than the. The problem with the Shrike is, it's like like Leslie said, it has a sh it has a lot of missiles for its size. I can't remember the number. I think it's over twenty missiles though for a light fighter. It's pretty insane. But the big issue is what I was saying about earlier. Like that payload is absolutely fine, so long as they stay away from you. But the Shrike, <laughs> it has a minimum range for the missiles, right? So if you're fighting and you shoot missiles and they fly too close to you, you've got like two size one guns. So if you can keep at the keep at the range and keep missiling them, then great. Otherwise, the Shrike is turd. I used to love the Shrike because I'm a big missile advocate. I love missile boats, but the Talon came out, which has the two size four gun, and then you had the Shrike, which has like two size ones but twenty odd missiles. So I was like, yes, alien missile boat, let's go. And all that happened is every time I went to fight something, I'd get to launch one barrage and then they fly straight towards me. So before I can lock the next one, they're within the minimum range. Yeah. So that's just one thing I would be very aware of because the Talon isn't like a retaliator where you've got that tankiness to like swing her around and fuck about trying to get the range. Like the Talon will get ripped apart quickly. Oh, the black kite's right there, so it looks like I don't have to scan for it. Nice. Nice. Um, but you're looking for a fighty ship, yeah? One that you can blow stuff I up don't know. in? I don't really... I don't really know. Because if you haven't got a hauler yet, a caterpillar could be a really nice ship. I have a cat. I have a cat. Yeah, they're really nice. you got a Corsair already. Mm-hmm. I have an Andromeda. Oh, Andros are nice. Uh, if you do want to try a missile boat, I don't know if it's available. It certainly should be available in game, but the Freelancer Miss. Yeah. Is that one of my. used to be one of my absolute favorite ships. You get like 36 missiles in it, and it's a Freelancer. Mm. So it's not too big, but it's kind of like a baby Andro, you know? <laughs> How's the Titan? The Titan? Titan. What do you mean? The smaller Valkyrie. Oh. Terrapin. He says Terrapin. Terrapin. Yeah. Uh, Many people love it. It doesn't do much, but it's a cool. It's basically useless, but it looks pretty cool, and I do love it. It's bit. tough. But as far as functionality, like, it's basically your no Yeah, it's just, uh, yeah, basically. But you can't, can't carry vehicles, so it's actually more like a, uh, Aurora. <laughs> <laughs> you have more room inside. Easier yeah, but you can't, bed, you, but you can't put it. anything in it. So, like, even the Avenger Titan, you can put a Grey Cat Rock in because it has a ramp. That's true. But you the Terrapin, you can't. Inside. That's yeah. it. And you can go from A to B. Of course, if you, want a, if, you just, maybe if you just want a ship that does A to B, though, with the functionality of a Terrapin, you could go and get a brand new Defender and have a Swaglicious Gold Alien ship. Okay. And I think the Defender has more guns than a Terrapin as well. Bigger ones. Yes. Terrapin has only two, maybe size two, maybe not even that. <laughs> or 
if you really like the design of the Shrike, you could try the Talon. It's it's just a it's a Shrike, but like I say, instead of the missiles, it has two size four guns. Yeah. So that can be pretty naughty. Very nimble as well, so it's quite easy to keep those guns on target, like even when you fly fixed. Okay, we go Oh, yeah. No useful guns. And if you really, really want a cool ship, I don't know if you've flown one oh. before, you probably have, but the Car Tual can also yeah, have a uh, two sides. Ship. Yeah, looks wise, same. It's just a shame it's made of bloody tissue paper. Yeah, and it falls over. Yeah. Patch. It doesn't sit straight up. Mm. Yeah, it really needs some love, to be honest, but. Damn, when you put that landing gear up, it makes you feel glad to be alive, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Wow. That's the thing, I used to love the alien ships so much. Because like, I hit Concierge, I only had like three ships in it because of the fucking alien tax. <laughs> it put me straight to Concierge. I had like a Defender, a Cartual, and a. Talon, I think. Like, I had a couple of like human ships, like the Freelance Abyss and uh, Cutlass Black. And I was already at $1,000 before I knew what was going on. <laughs> I'm going in front of you. I have only one shot. Okay. What what weapon? With a pistol. Arc light? Pistol. Oh, Salvo. Oh, I, can't, I can't give you frag ammo. I could have given you uh, it's okay. arc light ammo. No there's a guy here. There's a guy here. Bedroom's clear. Yeah, but the other room, there's a guy. Okay, coming out. You got him. No, he's still inside. He's down. He's definitely not down. He is. There's no one in here. Just I mean, this dead guy. But nobody shot him. No, I didn't hear any shots. <clears throat> Maybe he died of natural causes. <laughs> Maybe. But now I have a gun. Nice. Oh, you can actually pick up these pyramid refills off the table, you know. It's pretty dope. Oh, that's cool. Alright, I got the key. Okay, cool. Let's just uh, finish clearing these corridors and then we need to head to the back again. I'm gonna head right. Go left, Bjorn Stringer. Okay, corridor is clear. Clear. Sorry. Okay. Let's head back to the back of the ship and use the elevator to go down. If we all stick together, there's less chance of the elevator messing about. I like this mission more than the 890, to be honest. It feels like a legit op, you know, rather than... Because the 890, you've got that timer in it, so realistically, more often than not, you end up running around like a headless chicken trying to find the iPod. Whereas this, you can, like, take your time, play it pure Navy SEAL style. Aero, how did you end up so far away? You died, didn't you? I'm standing right next to you guys. Oh, it says you're well, 48 not, not, not million kilometers away from me. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this yeah, is it. Contact. On the right, on the right. He's down. Left guy is still there, hiding behind cover. I shot him in the face. That's cool. There's another guy. Ah, he shotgun me in the chest. Oof, I'm down. I'm, I'm in capped. You got him? Thank I'll cover you. you. I got you covered. Where the fuck is that? Okay, I don't have anything for you. Yeah, you got him up? Yep, I'm up. Oh, I need a weapon, guys. I don't think the enemies can see me either. We 
which is good if you can still <laughs> shoot them. <laughs> yeah, I can. Yeah, but most of have still. I don't think see the room's in the clear. Uh, yeah, well, this is clear. Can I use the key? I probably have any weapons. I can't help you because I don't see you, but just, just ease that. You? I got a, I got a submachine gun and a, and, and ah, a pistol. Hey, come with me, Paul. I'll, I'll show you something cool in it. See this hole? Yeah. Oh, yep. <laughs> There's a grenade oh, launcher look. here. Left a burrito here. Here you go. Eat have a two. grenade launcher for free. Pretty nice, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Then I just use this multi tool to move this box out the way and clear our path out. And the job's a good one. Hello? You have to let me know where you are because I have no idea. I was trying to eat a burrito. I'm in the elevator now. We need you to bring it down to a yeah, salvage that's why hold, I asked please. You. <laughs> Hell yeah! How do we get out of here? Yeah, just through here. What the fuck? Why did I push? Savage hold. Savage hold is not what, what we want. Or I don't know what happened because we didn't went there. You're, you're on the right floor now. You're on the right floor now. Yeah, but I, I pushed the same button. Yeah, the left to janky. Yes, yeah, it starts cycling through every floor no matter what button you push, so... Oh, for fuck's sake. Pi? No, you try to get through Hold on. them with actual fresh okay back to the 890 and then we just blow this sucker up I love that mission that's one of my favorites So boarding action I like too, like anything where you like have a bit of flying. I know this doesn't really have ship combat like the 890 does, but anywhere you fly on any EVA and then do ground and then back again, I think they're so cool. And I just, I think this one's just nicer because like I say, it doesn't have you running around like a dickhead trying to find a little iPad. You just take your time, enjoy the scenery. Free grenade launcher as well. <laughs> Contact. Okay, let's back up a bit so Leslie can get range with those missile turrets. One point two kilometers is the minimum. Okay. You should have range now yep. then. I do. Really, so do I. Except I can't lock on to it for some reason. Which is very strange. <laughs> Dumb firing this one. But I'm out of ordnance now, so. So, on you boys. 
Eva, you want to grab front turret? Yeah, heading to that one. Those missile turrets are cool, I just don't think they're very effective, you know. It's really interesting that the, the missile pool is, is common. It's shared yeah. by the four turrets. It's weird, isn't it? Honestly, I know the 890 is like a cruise ship, right? But like, you'd have thought it would have more missiles than eight size threes, I think the pilot has. And then yours is like 36 size twos, right? 32. 32. But still, like, you'd have thought on a ship this size, they'd have room for a lot more. I'm out. Or much bigger missiles. Okay, it's down to our remote turret then, boys. <laughs> Engine seat. If anyone's downstairs and wants to get in the lower turret, that is uh, in the hangar 2 behind the basketball net. I'll move us a bit closer. This is not the one. Should have turned the shields off. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. My new shields are nearly down. This isn't as cool as that full explosive hammerhead. <laughs> that was so cool. Really puts into perspective how big those explosions are as well, because like yeah, it was. the whole reclaimer was covered in explosions when we were using those explosive kind of like stuff. A hell mm -hmm. of a yeah. blast radius. Oh, that looked good. Okay, hey, well there's a little 12.5k, so you got a, little, a, a little lump in your pocket from tonight. Just a little bit. Yeah. And uh, about to go blow millions. <laughs> yeah. Are you going back to New Babbage? Yeah. Oh, cool, I'm gonna pay on my debt. Which this mission doesn't cover fully, but most of it. <laughs> you did it out of the kindness of your heart. I mean, it's five past now. If there's another good mission, I don't mind doing another one quickly, but it would definitely have to be one. And there doesn't seem to be much out here, because it's uh, just a claim jumper. Mike L2. And the war missions and yeah. one last there's. I don't want to do a war mission. No. <laughs> We've somehow managed to avoid Prime Star all night, despite having stolen goods and evading arrest, so... <laughs> I'm not about to go do a Vaughan mission now. <laughs> Although arguably I wouldn't get a Prime Star because I'm on the pilot. Jurisdiction of Microtech now, so let's have another double look. Just see. Um, nothing that's jumping out at me that looks good. I'm not seeing anything that's particularly worth staying up for. Let's go back to bed go to sleep. Oh. 
I have a busy day. I'm starting my second week of work. Oh. Yeah, I, I have to. I have to. What's the new job? Uh, no, no, new job is same job. I just don't have to work. I'm on holiday. Oh yeah. <coughs> it's Monday tomorrow, isn't it? Good lord. Yeah. <laughs> it is Monday, but it's today, even for you. I'll sleep all day. I'll sleep till Tuesday. No, not really. <laughs> I'm gonna sleep for a while. Oh, I'm gonna try to finish the, the mule episode. Where are you, space pool? That way. Oh, literally there. game is something else. Every time I fly into New Babbage, it's just breathtaking. So cool. Even with the static clouds. Yeah. They look a lot better than they used to, to be honest. Like, and they are going to look even better. And just look at that view chat, if I hide in game chat, that's spectacular, isn't it? Posted an unusual amount of screenshots today. I mean, not today, today, today. In this session. I don't blame you. Oh, I'm taking one of that. That's gorgeous. Yeah. Yeah. I have. Um, almost, the, almost the same. Look at the see. mountains in the background that look all pink because of the light getting broken yeah. up or whatever, that's yeah, so yeah, yeah. gorgeous. Should probably slow down. <laughs> ah. <clears throat> Almost home, boys. Break for no one. You need a sticker. <laughs> a bumper sticker. <laughs> I'm balls. honestly surprised Bobbleheads and fucking dashboard flags came out before bumper stickers do like what the fuck mm -hmm. you can add a bobblehead on my dashboard but you can't give me like seven slots for bumper stickers <laughs> i want to just cover the 890 jump in bumper stickers 100 percent coverage yeah, people are doing that with cars. Like the ship is orig underscore 890 jump and you can't change it because you bought the shipping game oh, yeah. have you ever um, seen those cars people actually do that not necessarily bumper stickers but there's like cars i guess it's like the same design as skateboards the same aesthetic but like they're they're outside will just be completely covered in stickers like that's the look in it just completely 100 percent covered in stickers looks pretty cool sometimes like you see i see these cars online that so they have like the patina on the side to make them look like rusted like a hot rod and then just the bonnet has like the completely sticker covered effect looks pretty cool Landing bay. Oh, this one. All right. If any, 
thing you scared of something right there. Landing gear down. This is going to be interesting. Why? They've given me one of the pads in the tower, so I have to like do a vertical landing. That's true. Oh, and I lined up to the wrong one, so that's not particularly helpful. <laughs> but you, you got the bigger one. Yeah. <coughs> interesting that I don't see the hangar number outside. Many of them has a number outside, but I don't see what it is. Strange. I hope this works. It looks like we're directly above it. Uh, uh, uh. It always does, but this time it's probably true. We're in. Hey. Landing complete. Have a pleasant stay. Ooh. Not too shabby. Nope. My FPS went to hell. Awesome. So I'll store the ship and then all the boxes and vehicles and stuff should stay in here. Yes. And we'll go find someone to raid. <laughs> oh, the lid disappeared completely. Oh, oh. it's back. So just using the laws of quantum physics. It's only there if you look at it. It's very, very maybe. Modern. Yeah. I do actually have a fine. For possession of stolen property, oh, 4,000. Yeah, I can pay it here. But yeah. I don't have a crime star, so I'm thinking I just won't pay it. <laughs> These guys are not killing me, which is... I had the fine as well. I just hey! It. Total fine 20,000. Nice. Jeez. But now I am... You are inside me, or I am inside you. Yeah. Oh okay. My. <laughs> okay. Let me so pull each other the, dinner first. I got uh, a little intimate. <laughs> I think I'll leave. Oh, wait, I need to store the shit before I start staring at Pico. Do I have to claim my ship now that it's inside yours? Uh, possibly. <laughs> it's my stolen goods now, Leslie. Yes, it says <laughs> Store your ship and then I'm, I'm gonna check back, check back. I just tried, but it didn't seem to do it. They don't seem to want to store it. Well, Maybe because it's about. filled with stolen goods. <laughs> Pull out a different ship and then store it. Oh yeah. Vehicle selected. Stand by. From all of us at Microtech. Welcome to the new. Let's see what happens. They won't let me. <laughs> Could I fly out? 
we just claim it. <laughs> but claiming it doesn't remove it from your ship. Now it says I'm blocking an active flight bay. Yeah, they, they literally say they're unable to deal with my request. They won't store my ship. So, Leslie, I'm going to open the hangar for you. And then you can fly out. Where is that? Uh, I couldn't tell you. Yeah, me neither. Because my ship's marker is... 19 or 20, right? It would have to be 19 or 20. Oh, well, apparently now they're initiating ship storage procedure, so I guess, it, <laughs> I guess it's getting stored one way or another. Oh, it's It's not 19. I think it might be stored by the time you get there. It's possible. I think it just got stored. <laughs> it's not 20, so I'm going for 18. Still there. The marker, at least. Oh, yeah, the rover marker's there. They're just getting further and further away, so it's not, <laughs> not 18. 14, okay. <laughs> Oh yeah, I could just check the screen, couldn't I? Yeah, you could. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Uh, oh, we're closer than ever, but it's not. Hangar 16. Oh, nice. Uh, Johnny Kill, new but Savage is remarkably active and looking stable. What wickedness is this? Yeah, it's been actually pretty good today. We haven't even had a 30k, have we? Oh, it's been great. Okay. And we've been live for, I've been live for 5 hours and 20 minutes now. Thank you so much for the follow, Bob and Johnny. I appreciate yeah, my you, my inside, dude. Yeah, my for fuck's sake. How's your day been? You do catch us as we're like shutting off for the evening, to be honest, because it's 20 past midnight for me here. Errol. Let's yep. do it this way. Get my rover out of the ship. Just into the hangar, and I'm gonna try to fly out. But the roof <laughs> is not open, Ram, by the way. Oh, really? Hold on then. Comlink, friends, New Babbage International Space Oh, Board. shit. You're talking about air. Yeah. Okay, that's gonna be confusing. Oh, yeah, we've got Aero and Eero now. <laughs> We'll have to use your full name, Irokun, innit? I guess so. Damn. But to be fair, I'm about to log off, so it's probably not going to cause huge issues. <laughs> We're just trying to liberate Leslie's 100 eye from my 890. At the moment. I mean, they are not opening the door, so I'm going to oh. just fly out and then land it in the hand. Oh, so. Opal! Opal, what ship do you want then? I know you. Oh, nice parking job. Ivo, tell me a ship that you like that is available to buy in game right now. Pisces. Yeah, you need to come to my stream and get your Pisces. I am on the stream. Oh, what's your name? You will see in a few seconds. Oh, you subbed. Well, then, if you've subbed, I'm gonna just give you the link because you can now choose any ship you want, any of them, because you're subbed. It doesn't even have to be available in game. You could have a Corsair now. This was genius. I've got like two subs just today. That's like a whole year's worth of subs in one night. I should have made the avatars pay to win ages ago. <laughs> 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 I could have been rich, chat. Rich! <laughs> what the fuck is happening here? It's Christmas. Sup? Yeah. But, uh, um, what, Opal, if you tell me a ship that's available in game, I can, uh, I can gift you it. 400 eyes, quite nice. Too bad it's not. And it's stored now. Cool. <laughs> Just got into the ship. <laughs> I can give you a 400 eye. I don't know how big it is. I'll have to like scale well, it probably. Oh, that looks okay actually. That 400 eye looks quite solved. nice. 
It gave me a crime stat. And you know what? Because it's you as well, Opal. Why? And you, you specifically mentioned the Nox to go in the front hangar. I'm also going to gift you the Nox avatar. Oh, that's way too big. Okay, we're going to sort that one out. Because once you've got it unlocked, it should be unlocked kind of thing. So let me just resize the Nox because that's disgusting. It's bigger than the fucking Aurora. How long <laughs> does it take to install these avatars? I'm like waiting. It just says installing avatars. Oh, that's because I've just disconnected them. So it's going to be infinite right now. Um, usually not that long, like a couple of minutes. So let's try 0.25. So we'll half the size of that Nox. And maybe that'll be okay. If not, I'll have to adjust it another time. How's that, Nox? Yeah, that looks very small and tragic now. That's about Nox size. <laughs> there was a PTB running around before, but Buttspot has died somehow. Join kill, let's put you back as a 400 eye, bless you. You don't want to be a shitty little Nox, do you? But you've got the option just in case. There you go. Origin 400 eye. How about that? Have they loaded for you, Irokun? Yeah, the bottom layer is Terraria, so I have like a couple of uh, fresh to take. Oh, Aero, you've got a sub now to choose any ship you want to. So we've actually got a few different backgrounds. We've got none, which just has everything floating. We have this one, which has a little sign and a butterfly, so that's quite cute. <laughs> we have the evil biomes from Terraria, which is kind of cool for like a fucked up evil planet. I just thought like the stream fleet should be able to visit different planets, right? So we've got a Halloween planet. That's a Terraria one. This is like a default one. Uh, you've got this one from Terraria with a little bunny. Uh, you've got that one, but without the trees being annoying. And then you got this one and that one without trees. And then you've got the snow biome with Christmas, snow biome without Christmas. And then we've got two from Slime Rancher called Dry Reef. But they really reminded me of like Aberdeen or Damar. So I thought we'd add these in case we were ever like doing missions around Damar or Aberdeen. You know, we've got a nice desert biome as well. And then you've got SR Dry Reef Simple, which is the same, but without the cliffs at the side. So I thought that was a nice little, nice little change of scene now and then. So we're not always in the same place. But obviously during Luminalia, we'll keep this one up because it's got the old Luminalia tree. <laughs> yeah, the overlay. Because we we used to use just the straight green line along the bottom. It was nice because it had a ground for the ground vehicles to go on, but. I remembered I used to have these like themed backgrounds back in the day before I filled the extension limit with avatars and obviously now I'm not doing that. I'm only using the Star Citizen ones. I thought, well, why not? Eh? Let's, let's have a bit of change of scene now and then. Is it the uh, channel points that we need to use to... No, it's a uh, loyalty currency. So if you type exclamation mark UEC, you can see how many you've got. Channel points you can redeem and you spend them on a mini game. So say you chose Battle Royale, UEC, like uh, in game. So Leslie's just done a slot machine and you can gamble with the loyalty currency to earn more. But the, the channel points basically you'll redeem them to activate mini games. So if you redeem a Battle Royale, I then do this and a Battle Royale starts. And then all the avatars start shooting the fuck out of each other. It's great. <laughs> like carpet bombing. Oh, what ship is... Oh, that is a Pisces, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Let me find someone to raid while we do this.
Is it okay if I post in ST chat? Uh, yeah, it's okay, but I mean, <laughs> I want them to use my referral code, but sure, I don't care yeah. what you put in there. Can you check out the new sweater? Yeah, it looks nice. Hey, you won! Nice, Johnny. It is completely random. <laughs> but yeah, Eero, you can post your uh, referral link in Star Citizen chat. Thank you. I will want an Argo Cargo. I don't know if I get one though. This is the only reason. I've got that. I've got FOMO again. Instantly. <laughs> I buy. I bought a javelin, right? And I swear that has a parasite Argo cargo. But if I don't get a parasite Argo cargo included with it, then I'm gonna have a parasite Argo cargo bay with no Argo cargo, which is a bit shit. <laughs> and I know because it's a parasite one, I'm not gonna be able to just slap an arrow in there or something, you know? Like it's a specifically designed bay for it. But I don't know if I get one included or not. You should buy a lottery ticket. I don't know if that's good advice to give. <laughs> How do oh, do an Orion! Holy shit, okay. The Orion needs to be a little bigger, actually. Let me just change, sort that out. I have to, like, scale them all individually, you know? So I have to, like, exit. So that's at 1.25. Whenever the, the Orion gets released... I don't care whose dick I have to suck. I'm getting it. Well, it's funny you should say that because uh, one of the packs I actually want to get is the Tycoon pack, which has an Orion in it. So I'm hoping to have one by like June next year. By Invictus, I should hopefully have one again. If not, by IAE next year, I'll definitely have one. <laughs> don't you think the Orion will be released in like two or three years? I don't know. Um, I, I just want to have all my fleet in order by uh, IAE next year, to be honest. And then I'm going to start pledging for credits and startup funds. But yeah, I'll start preparing my dick, shall I, for when it comes out. <laughs> he, he, he didn't say I'm he wants to fly yours for a, for a blowjob. But Still. why? Yeah. But you so can expensive. Prepare, of course, just in case. Yeah. It's always good to be prepared. That's a nice choice though, no one's chosen an Orion yet. It's actually nice seeing one flying around, even if it's only a teeny tiny 8-bit one. It looks so cool. That's a really nice avatar model. Because some of them are really low detail, like the hammerhead looks fucking awful. But that Orion actually looks really legit. That's really nice. Because I'm going to switch back to my baby now. Uh, someone, uh, a few days ago, I saw uh, a 3D rendering of uh, the supposed uh, new mining ship that they're working on. Oh, yeah. And it looks absolutely brilliant. What it has manufacturer? One, one, it has one, I think it was RSI. Oh. One, yeah, it has one mega uh, mining drill and two extra nice but it's not the galaxy it's something else i don't remember the name no it's the, the we remember we had we had a vote a few months ago yeah yeah at uh citizen con supposedly they're making a two-man uh, mining ship which i have wanted for a long I time i thought it was going to be between the mole and the orion yeah, so that, that would be bigger than two yeah. man. Yeah, it is because it's it's technically a three man. And it can carry a, a ground vehicle. Yeah, it can like carry a breakout like rock. Oh, yeah, that's actually interesting because I wanted a, a mole. Because essentially, the reason I want the Tycoon pack, right, is it comes with like a prospector, a Vulcan, a Vulture. Like it has a single crew and a multi crew for all of the industry stuff. Now, I fucking hate prospectors, so I was going to upgrade that into a mole. If there's going to be a mole with room for a grey cat, I might have to switch my plans up a bit there, because that sounds fucking badass. The thing is, the RSI mining ships will all have uh, room for shit like a Pisces or ground vehicles in the back, and uh, all of them will have an onboard refinery. 
Really? You're right, so it's going to have room for a ground vehicle and a mobile refinery in it? Yeah, it has an onboard refinery on the top deck. So you can refine it just, it's going to work like the, the salvage ships, apparently, where you refine it and it comes in boxes, so you can transport it with, for instance, a Pisces. You can transport it into another ship. I don't know how I feel about that now, I think, because that just basically gimps the Orion. It does, but the Orion supposedly is a, the only planned ship that's going to be able to mine the massive, massive, massive ones. Yeah. Because it, apparently it has a st what they call a super mining uh, thing. Probably not size 2. No, <laughs> we're talking size 4 or 5. To be fair, isn't like the entire front of the Orion one giant mining laser? It is. Yeah. And you're gonna have uh, apparently they're gonna be mining asteroids that's one tenth of a moon size. Fucking hell. So you can technically land on them and shit. Yeah, I really want to see the sinless mining drone. You know that big spider fucker. Yeah. I want that so bad. <laughs> We've seen that shit in trailers for years. I know, just like clamped onto a asteroid, like this is mine. <laughs> I want I've, it. All the info I've seen about it is people thinking it's really small, one ship crew. No, it, they're it's not. fucking it's, huge. Yeah, they're massive. Like I'm pretty sure the only things that would be able to deploy it is like an Orion or a fucking Pioneer or something, like a capital-sized vessel, you know. Yeah, but it doesn't. It doesn't have any engines. It only has thrusters. Yeah, that's all right though. Yep. Imagine like seeing a rock miner going around, and you just fucking stomp on him with you. <laughs> Random thought that could lead to bad things happening in game. How about loading a Pisces with four large suits and destructing it for the cargo boxes? There are two SCU and rectangular, and loading one into the 400 spike ramp. Um, I don't know. That's too much for my brain to process right now. <laughs> oh, the big, the big rectangular boxes. Yeah, that would probably result in the 400 eye blowing up very quickly. I think it would explode quite dramatically. The bike um, elevator on the 400i is real small. Like, I don't think you can even yeah. fit a dragonfly on it. You can't put the two SCU cargo box there. I mean, you can, you just can't close it. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Anyway, guys, I'm going to find someone to raid. We've been staring at Pico long enough. If you have any recommendations, let me know. Blasphemy. <laughs> Yeah, that is a bit sacrilegious. I'm sorry, Pico. I don't know. I see three Star Citizen, Star Citizen streams. Oh, yeah? Who are they? No, no, no. Four, five, six. There is Dark Hour 717. Yeah, I caught him. Dread Pirate. Devil who's, Obri. Who's that? Dread Pirate. Dread Pirate. P Y R O I D. There's, there's every 11 and then 6 six slash no 6 what the hell okay so someone and then the 5 star oh dread pyroid I see these are my recommended channels oh to chill du soir that's, all, that's French <laughs> I love watch I love like the French accent and that, but I don't think raiding someone with a French title is gonna be a good Raid someone with a low well, this guy's got account. two viewers, Venku Skirata, King of the Javelin. You can give him five more or four. Wait, I know that name. He was at the eight ninety party. You know what? We'll we'll raid him. I'm gonna assume they're a cool guy and not horrible. Uh, there's one channel that has a giveaway today, giving a hurricane. What what channel is that? Snack packing. Let's see if I can see them, and I'll judge them based on their thumbnail. 
<laughs> oh yeah. Well, he doesn't look he hasn't got a very exciting thumbnail. Ah, uh, fuck it, he's American. Nope. I'm yeah. a red chewed. I don't, I don't know who this Venku Skirata is. Like, I recognize the name from the 890 party, but I think we're just going to raid good old chewed. He's a gem. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's playing Star Citizen right now. Somebody clip that. 50 viewers he's got. No, kind of please. Oh, oh, there he is. His thumbnail looks exciting. He's in a, he's in the oh, orange I need, I need a I need a coat. Are you sure that's Star Citizen? That isn't. No, that's just a random clip from his channel. Oh, okay. I'm kind of intrigued by this Venku Skirata though. Why has he put King of the Javelin? <laughs> I'm the King of the Javelin. How dare you? <laughs> That's why I'm not raiding him secretly, chat. <laughs> it's just jealousy. <laughs> but right, we're gonna raid you guys. I'll be back tomorrow with I don't fully know what to be honest. It's a Monday, so we'll see what we're feeling like. Thank you all for watching and until then Peace. See you around mate.